resume expedition here. Yo, Starlight sinks to the 20 months with the Prime. Uh, Nikki, I'll probably play the DLC, yeah. Once I, like, <gasps> figure out what's going on, I'll, I'll definitely play it. Yo, what up, Rob? How you doing, dude? Yo, balls for you. Thanks for the 100 bits. Also, uh, thanks for this, man. Really, really stoked on this little guy. Thank you so much for sending this to the P.O. Box. <laughs> the Bucky's Beaver. You want to throw that guy so far? My mortal enemy, yeah, for real. He's just staring at me as I play this game. Anytime I die now, he's just going to look at me and laugh. Okay, let's, um, let's read some ship logs here and see what the vibe is. So, what do we know? Okay, the sun station. Uh, debated building a sun station in order to power the Ash Twin project. The Nomai built something called the Sun Station, but not everyone supported its construction. Cool. Um, this one. This is Ember Twin. Oh, there's a ton of things about Ember Twin. Oh my God. There's a gravity cannon on the sh on the uh, planet. There's quantum caves. There's a high energy lab we need to find out more information on. There's a sunless city. There's more to explore here. So that's good to know. Skate Pod 2, we already uh, checked that out. The anglerfish fossil we got to. Um, uh, kids used to play, I guess, near this when they were like the Nomai children. Used to game around it. Church camp. The lake bed cave is a wandering rock that was first spotted in a cave at the bottom. That's the one I think that moves around. Uh, there might be more to explore here too. And then uh, the quantum moon locator. This is the weird thing that I didn't know how to do yet. That like moves around and it keeps track of like all the planets. So there's something here to do with the uh, quantum moon, I think. Okay, that's Ember Twin, Ash Twin. This is the Ash Twin project. The central chamber inside Ash Twin was physically sealed off by an immensely thick protective shell. Several large Nomai towers form a ring around Ash Twin's equator. The White Hole Station was used as a model for these towers, which were built for the Ash Twin project. Okay. The Atler Rock. Uh, a Nomai device created to pinpoint the uh, sources of distant signals. The Nomai were disappointed by their failure to detect a signal from something called the Eye of the Universe. So the Eye of the Universe is the thing that I think they're trying to find or look into. And we, fa we found out that the Nomai are like nomads and they travel around in, the, in their giant ships to like, I think, learn more. And like, that's their whole like culture. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that's kind of like what they do. Like they're, they like to travel and learn. Um, and little like groups get sent out to do their, I think it's either by themselves or like small uh, groups go out and do stuff. The Nomai were disappointed by their failure to detect a signal from something called the Eye of the Universe, uh, the Lunar Lookout, spectacular view of the solar system. Esker uses their signal scope here to keep tabs on the other travelers. They love exploring, okay. What's up, Groot? Esker is growing a crop of trees in their camp. They seem to be doing okay, but they've probably been alone on the moon for too long. Okay. I think it said they're supposed to be nomads. Oh, okay. That's what it was. So like their whole purpose was to explore and they weren't able to do it. And that's maybe that they were trying to get off their ass again or something. <clears throat> there's there's a zero G cave, the no my mines. This this is on our, our home planet, Timber Heart. Yo, Ghostface, hell yeah. Hell yeah, dude. I found a poem written on one of the trees in the grove. So the, the quantum grove is confusing but it says there's nothing there's nothing left to do here which is weird and the dark bramble see we need to get back to dark bramble uh and figure out how to get inside of it because there's i think a person in there who has more information and we know that it's much bigger on the inside similar to a tardis which is cool okay this is brittle hollow the Southern Observatory. The Nomai uh, decided to build a larger, more sophisticated eye signal located on Brittle Hollow South Pole. Ryback says you can't get into the observatory from your uh, from the surface. They tried, but there's probably a path to it beneath the crust somewhere. Okay, Brittle Hollow is like the big place that's wild, with the black hole in it. Um, and there's like we found the old settlement. We found uh, the Hanging City. There's more to explore here, so I need to go back there and check more out. 
and the Black Hole Forge. It's, uh... Okay, yeah, I, I, need, to, I, I need to go back here and do a bunch of shit for the, for the Hanging City. Yeah, Dark Brambles, Wibbly Wobbly, Timey Wimey. Volcanic Testing Site. Even the smallest cracker opening in this protective shell will destroy everything. The Nomai were trying to craft a briefly supernova-proof shell to encase the Ash Twin Project. Okay, this is the or Orbital Probe Cannon. Uh, the launch model, the probe tracking module, and the control module. Okay, so this, there's still more to explore. Uh, it's a, it's the Nomai space station that was in orbit around Giant's Deep. There are three uh, uh, access ways branching off from the central hub area. Yeah, Hanging City was cool. That was fun exploring the other day. Gabros Island, the construction yard, the quantum signal, the statue island. There's definitely more to do here. This is where those statues with the three, four eyes, I think, are built. Gabro says there's a strong current beneath the uh, surface of the ocean that prevents anything from sinking below it. Okay. So we need, we need to explore more at the construction yard as well. Dark Bramble. There's a vessel and inside the sea. When I launched the scout into the seed that crashed on Timber Hearth, it ends up in a much bigger space with fog and thorny vines. So the third escape pod is, is expected to be here. That's cool. The White Hole Station. Every Nomai Warp Tower is tuned to this uh, specific astral body. Okay, that's the White Hole place. Um, Frozen Nomai Shuttle is on the interloper. And then uh, there's some energy readings as well happening here. <clears throat> okay, now let's look at... Th so this is all the different stuff and how they potentially connect. So, that's interesting. So that's all the anglerfish shit uh, and, like, the Sun City stuff. This is the Ash Twin Project. Uh, what's up, Babs? How you doing? What up, Jenny Bean? Thanks for the Prime. This is the Quantum Moon. We need to, f we need to get on the Quantum Moon at some point. And this is uh, the Orbital Pro Camera. Okay, so... I think maybe we go back to the Hanging City, the Quum, and check out what's going on with that, like, the hearth, maybe. Uh, like the, the black hole area. Let's see what that vibe is. Babs, congratulations, by the way. Let's go. The Hanging City, here we go. Brittle Hollow, engage in autopilot. Have a blast, have a good time, enjoy yourself. Astro, I think we do have a lot of time, a lot of story left. I don't know much, but I feel like we, we definitely have stuff to do still. <laughs> okay. We're gonna try getting to the uh, Hanging City and explore more down there. Oh, that's fine. It's always fun playing this game when you haven't played it in a while. And there we go. Yeah, there's also a chat in Discord, guys, uh, for, for spoilers, if, you, if you're curious about, um, like, stuff. And want to uh, complain about how I'm, like, missing something or, like, how I just almost found something out but then like didn't or whatever what up Tori how you doing what up Reyna how are you oh yeah icky I couldn't believe that because I knew I knew there was like a, a moment where the sun does explode at some point oh, look at this everything everything lines up I think at some point too which we have to keep in mind How do I go? Oh, there we go. Hmm. Ow. I need, to get, I need to get to the Hanging City ASAP. Hello? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna go up here real quick. Heal up. 
fuel up and go back down. Okay. There's gonna be an entrance somewhere. Oh, there it is. Hanging city. Yo, Sherbert with the five. What the hell? Yo, thank you for the five gifted. No, no, I'm not starting over. No, no, no. This is uh This is my this is my third day playing. This game made your vertigo act up. Oh, I'm sorry. Bro, Sherbert, thank you, dude. What the heck? There, okay, I was I knew I knew I had a flashlight. I am gonna start over my Stardew Valley uh, farm, I think. What's up, Storm Winds? How you doing, Hannah? <clears> hey, <throat> we need to figure out how to get to the hanging city without getting close to this black hole. What up, Andrew? Guys, you can thank Andrew for me playing this game, by the way. Okay. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna, maybe, I'm gonna maybe just try making this jump, or is that silly? Oh, I could probably also go there across those hmm might just do that instead you been think about this min this game for a minute I mean dude, I like it a lot I like it a lot I think it's fun what up Sam how we doing dude hope you're doing well jump I, I, I always forget if this is like possible yeah like what the fuck is that okay we're still we're fine we're fine we're a little banged up but other than that we're chilling we're in the hanging city now this is where we wanted to go there's still more to explore here. In the hotel with a glass of wine and an edible? Oh yeah, you're chilling hard. <laughs> you are chilling hard. Okay. Can I go down one more floor, I wonder? There's that. Hmm. We Yeah, we are one shot. Not looking good. She hang on my city till I out her wilds. Okay, so there's that. There's that. Okay, we're still chilling. Got a scroll. goes down now. I feel like I need to go over here, but I don't know what is up. tank refill let's go that's huge ghost matter nearby yeah we know maybe this scroll has something that we don't know yet let's try it out Let's see why should we build we should build a new vessel <clears throat> 
Each Nomite clan explores the universe in its own vessel. The vessel is the heart of every clan. It's unusual for Nomite to remain in one place for so long. Nomite are wanderers and have no permanent home. If we built it, okay, so this is what we, we found out how their ship is their home. Imagine all the new places we can go. Our clan wouldn't be stuck here in the star system. We can even meet other Nomai and learn from them like Kaloya said we used to do. It's pro it it would, probably wouldn't be hard to get parts if we stopped building other new things. So they wanted to get back into the stars. That was their whole, like, goal. I asked Yara, he says we, we use a lot of resources on the Ash Twin project. Okay. So maybe, maybe we'll find out that they, that they did get out, or maybe they didn't. Yeah, there's a bunch of little skeletons over here. Ruthie, you just called me a circle, you know? Bro said you're a blue circle. It's very depressing. Yeah, it is. Oh, what is that over there? I always think it's a little blue owl. Guys, it's me. It's your, it's your boy. Ghost matter detected. We need to figure out... Oh, shit! I'm one shot. Hmm. Surface integrity 100%. Hmm. Not sure what that means. We might be screwed. Try again. Ooh. Okay, so that's is that the white hole maybe? I don't know. There's still something to do here, but I don't know like what area to go check out. Maybe up maybe up more? I don't know how to fucking get down there. I want, I want to go check all that shit out, but like, that's like in the black hole. This fucking thing. Black hole forge controls. Here we go. This is what I need to do. Oh my god, it's going all the way up there. Okay, wait. That's huge. area seems new. This whole area seems new. Shit. A lot of skeletons over here. What is this fucking thing? <laughs> Be welcome to this place. The shrine is a space to reflect on what brought us to this star system, the signal from the eye. We observed the eye's signal in our travels and followed it here to find its source. What we know is the source of the signal, which we have chosen to call the eye of the universe, is older than <laughs> this universe itself. The rest we have yet to learn. 
Enter and open your mind to its possibilities. Okay. What is the eye of the universe? The eye is the source of the signal that brought us here. So the eye's here. Suppose the eye is a more advanced being. The eye is older than the universe, so imagine how much it could teach us. Perhaps it is a cosmic library. Oh. How can the eye be older than the universe itself? Suppose it's a relic from a previous universe. The early universe was unimaginably hot and dense. If anything existed before, it would have been destroyed. Suppose the universe is older than previously assumed. What is the eye signal? Of note, from the signal, we were able to determine the eye's approximate age, or perhaps its lack of age. Suppose the eye wishes to communicate. The signal is a call. Were we the intended audience? The signal is the eye's voice. It speaks a language we don't know yet. Or maybe the signal is the eye's attempt at expressing itself. Whoa. That's a lot of, is this the eye right here? No, shot. that's the eye right there, bro. That's not it, there's no fucking way that's it. Is it? Nah, come on. This is interesting. Just beat the game, yeah, we found the eye. We did it. I no longer believe as I did as a child on Ember Twin that the eye of the universe <laughs> wishes to harm us, but it may not want to be found either. Ooh. The terrible circumstances of our arrival here were almost certainly exactly what they bat circumstance. <laughs> I suspect imagining we are special to the eye in some way is wishful thinking. The eye might have called out to any sentient species. Or it might not have been calling out at all, and that my ancestors heard the eye signal holds no great deep meaning. This wouldn't be so bad, I think. In fact, the eye may not have wishes at all. We may have no evidence supporting this. Okay, so the eye is this big mystical be being, and we're not sure what the fuck it wants, or if it even wants us at all. Okay. Very interesting. Another classroom, it looks like. Perhaps some more dead kids. Yep, great. Some skulls. Hmm. More skeletons. I need to get up. I need to get up there more. Let me try the signal scope on this thing, actually, real quick. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, what is this? <laughs> I mentioned I've been hard on Poke again, and this is in turns that I've made things difficult for her sister, Clary. If Poke and I are oil and water, Clary is our emulsifier. She certainly makes us a better team than would mixing uh, through shaking, although sometimes I would like to shake Poke. Jokes aside, suppose my own fear of never finding the eye prompted my argument with Poke. That would be immature of me. I should apologize, at least to uh, Clary, who could then tell Poke. Dude, Diamante, do it. It's very fun. Get up to the freaking forge. Okay. It's right there. How do we get up there? See, there's no like.
I wonder if there's a way to like maneuver it so I could like hop on as it's going up or something. Yeah, the level design's very cool in this game. going down, I'm going to make it go back up and then run out and try to get on top of it. Come on. Shit. No, oh, okay. I think I can maybe do that. I think I, can, I think I can hit that. Once it goes back all the way down. If we time it right, it might be crazy, but it might work also. Bobby's, uh, he'll probably be in here later. He's definitely working still. Did that work? little bit. No fucking way. Oh no! Oh fuck. Oh my god. Hold on. No dick. Oh great. Hmm. Okay. This is definitely not the way you're supposed to do it, I'm pretty sure, but you know what? Sometimes you have to just figure it out yourself, huh? <clears throat> okay, now... Where do we go? Okay. What the fuck? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, boys. Huh? Is this right? Okay. I'm missing something there, probably. Chaw on the floor. Yeah, we're gaming. Now, anyone who's played this game before, how incorrect was that? Whatever I just did there, that was definitely not the way to do it, right? I feel like that was an accident, but we're, we're, we're going to take it. 30, 30 meters. Okay. So incorrect. Fuck yeah. You, lo you love to hear it. <laughs> you love to hear it, dude. Whoa! Oh, we're fucking screwed. Oh my god, wait. Oh, you can't jump. Oh, that's like, oh my God, that's, that, that's floor. Oh, oh, okay. That's floor. Oops. Okay. I get it now. Hmm. Wow. Okay. So that was, that's where I was just standing was on that. I didn't even realize it. Me learning to walk as a baby. I might just call it and die and then run it back because I feel like I want to go explore this now again. But I have like no health or fuel. Okay, let's just die on purpose here. Okay, that was a good uh that was a good run. We learned some stuff, I think, which is good. It's always good to learn stuff. It's cracked open a Diet Coke. Watch out. Yeah, chicken, I I agree. It's fun. And I think after playing like a lot of Fortnite and shit, like 
not even like capping, with like, like movement. These kind of games, you kind of like can think outside the box of what you're doing. What up, Joe? How you doing, dude? Okay. What up, eggs? Eggs, you missed it. I did. I, I did something silly. I think. Okay, let me check out uh, the new stuff that we that we got in our journal real quick. Nothing. We got no nothing new. Ah, oh, we're screwed. Oh, here we go. We got this is new though. The tower on uh, Brittle Hollow's equator held useful knowledge for Nomai embarking on their first pilgrimage. Nomai named Solon was told to visit the Tower of Quantum. I need to get to, I need to get there at some point. What did I do? Uh, I'll uh, I'm gonna go back and show you. I'm, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna go do it again. I have to repair, bro. Come on. Okay, we good now? Okay. Why is it not letting me? Okay, there we go. What's up, Pete? How you doing, dude? Quoom. Quoom. Okay. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Oops. So, guys, that happens. Right in the freaking asteroid. <laughs> cool. True, my ship is back to normal now. And that's all that matters. Okay, and here we go. doing that. There we go. <clears throat> what up, J Train? What is that? Well, that? That looks like a mushroom. 
How many hours in the playthrough? Uh, I think like maybe nine or ten. Could be more, could be less. Hundred and six, no way. interloper I think okay. you like that emo that's the boy Rob Law That's cool. Alpha, I, I got I got confused with the uh, both as well for a long time. Rob Law's law blog, exactly. There's the tower that I need to get into. There's the hanging city as well. Oh, that's not really good. Oh, okay, that's fine. We're still alive, folks. You're still alive. Perfect. Okay. And here we go. Same strat as before, guys. Same strat as before. This time it didn't work. This time it did not work, folks. It did work before, though. Now we are uh, fucking done. I'm, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to restart the loop. I don't feel like waiting to die. This game reminds you of the temple. Oh, I guess it has similar vibes to that. It does have similar vibes to that, I would say. Yeah, the elevator was waiting for me. Okay, why is loading taking forever? There we go. What's up, Connor? How you doing? This game reminds you of Subway Surfers. Okay. This game gave you space anxiety. <laughs> Space is pretty wild when you think about it. Yo, Tyler, thanks for the eight months. Appreciate that. Timber Hearth. Hollow's Lantern. Dark Bramble. Ember Twin, Giants Deep, Brittle Hollow, let's go there. I'm all good and too high to talk about space. I wonder if I could fly my ship into uh, the area that I'm trying to get to. Perhaps. What planet do we think has the best Wii? That's a good question.
Uh, no, we didn't die. We were just, um, we restarted because we were lagging. <clears throat> cool. And I think we're good. Okay. I'm not wearing my fucking... Bro! I thought I had my outfit on. Guess not. Dude died. Did we from Bramble listen to another one? Yeah. Probably. Ooh. That was a big breath. She did not like dying. Oh my god, look at our weird arms. Okay. Uh, it's over here. Okay. Yo, Jeezer, thank you, dude. Yeah, J Train, I already got that one. Balatro. You and Mark both just logged on to it. It seems like it, I, would, I would have a good time with it. What's up, Sky? How you doing, dude? Yeah, Kush, I saw you you even playing it. down there. Day's been good, dude. Ate some good food. Got some work done. Now we're playing Outer Wilds. Figuring out how the fuck to get to this uh, hanging city again. if this is uh where i should go with my ship maybe what's the premise of this game uh space okay space and exploring it What's up, Papa dude? How you doing, man? Ooh, that's not good. Yeah, Groove. I heard a lot of people were just ultimately like bummed with like the exploration aspect of it. Cause I heard 
like the physics and a lot of like other things were really good with it, but the exploration side of things were just like ass. Plus, like, the fact that I had to load every five seconds. So I didn't even bother with it. Yeah, Caroline, that's the bummer, I think, right? Whoa. Because I, I love a good exploration game. Yeah, you can walk on walls. It's it's pretty crazy. Ooh, Annihilation was a good movie. The book series is even weirder. Yeah, I liked it. I didn't read the book, though. Whoa. Oh my God. Yo, Sam, thanks for the prime, dude. I appreciate that. Rad bad, yeah. It's over here. So I'm gonna try catching myself in that freaking thing over there. My dude smacked his face. Yo, Dana, thanks for the 38 months, by the way. Tyler, welcome back as well. Good to see you. <gasps> okay. The Blade game from Arcane Bethesda. Is that coming out soon? What's that? That new movie coming out looks pretty good too with um, Bill Skarsgård. That looks awesome. I don't know if anyone saw any uh, previews for that or the trailer. It looks hype. I'm tired of Brittle. I'm tired of this fucking place, man. Brittle fucking hollow. Boy kills world. Yeah, that's it. That looks good. Okay. Yeah, what, what is it? Health and fuel. Good. 
Let me go over here. Use caution, a black hole s sleeps below you. Me landing a spaceship is trying to park IRL. All right, I'll go to Giant Steve next. Knowledge is too dear to lose. Here's everything we can recall about the signal we encountered while aboard the vessel. The signal looked like an eye around with a circle at the center, much like a pupil. Uh, suppose the signal was looking for something. The signal was older than the universe itself. This is the most significant detail. None of my clan has ever encountered anything like it. How can anything in this universe be older than the universe itself? Imagine what rare and profound knowledge it might offer. We must find the side of the universe. Pictures of the ships and the eye and much other shit. Okay. The other escape pods distracting uh distress signals which gave me hope volley are you still there i am unsure i'm uh unsure how to be without you oh that's actually really uh sad and cute the sad the sad face with the four eyes is cute Look out below. Look out for the gravity hole. For should you slip and lose your grip, then in space you'll go. Thanks. Deep giant or deep blue, or whatever the fuck it's called. 
and talk to Gabbro. <clears throat> Yo, Dana, thanks for the 38 months, by the way. Okay. Deep blue. Giants deep. Let's uh destruction yard, Gabros Island. Let's go there. Ariana, I don't know personally. Uh maybe. I don't know though. Um Gabros Island. go we go okay there's some space junk right there So there's um ghost matter over there which we can't touch yet. Here's Gabor. This is my time, buddy. How's space treating you this loop? I found something. I found your quantum poem. Oh yeah, the one in the woods. I, oh! It works out to a good 24 poems when I'm done exploring. <laughs> I just want to make some more quantum art. Maybe some kind of creature sculpture that just like shows up while your back is turned and scares the daylights out of you. Hello again. How do you stay so calm in the face of repeated impending death? Deep breaths. No, seriously, I meditate. Want me to teach you? It'll be the next loop before you know it. Sure, why not? Okay, close your eyes. That's huge. So instead of having to cancel every time. Thanks. <laughs> That's big. So you don't need to kill yourself. Thanks, Ags. That's a friend, guys. There we go. Oh, if you cancel, lose all the progress. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. What's up? What up? Oh, I'm cold. How you doing, dude? Good to see you, Zoe. Okay, let me, um... Atler Rock, Dark Bramble. Let's go here again. Are you going by Charlie now? Okay. What's up, Charlie? Nice to meet you. What's up, Jenna? How are you, dude? Yo, Shelby, thanks for the prime. How you doing, Shelby?
Yo, Becca Beans gifting a sub to LOL I'm Cold. Thank you, Becca. Yo, Pooty, I'm, ha I'm happy that I could help. I know moving sucks. Moving is not the vibe. Oh my god, a walnut almost fucking killed me. Here we go. Oh wait, that's a big piece that just fell off right here. Okay, so the black hole just got him pretty fast. The fact that we're like right here is actually pretty funny. I almost wonder if I want to try bringing this like over here more. You know? Oh. Come on. Ah, oh, you piece of shit. Oh, come on. Yeah, for refueling as well, yeah. Okay, wait. It's not it's like not letting me. It's saying, "Huh?" Threading threading the needle. I might just get out right here. It's good to have that right there, I think. It's just a little too thick. What's up, Maggie? Okay, let's try. I want to try that move again we did before. Even though it's not correct, I'm curious. Okay, here we go. We did it last time. Fuck. Oh, great. It's not looking good, guys. Okay. <clears throat> it's fine. We go. We go heal real quick at the ship that's right there, and we go again. How do I live? I'm different. We're different uh, when, we, when we play this game. My legs are broke, though. For sure. <laughs> That's what renting feels like. Okay. Where's my ship? Where's my super suit? Oh, there's my ship. Wait, and then we just... Oh, my God. You, dude, look at that. We just keep trying that stupid method, and eventually it's going to work. Yup. Yup. That's the way to do it. Definitely an easier way to do it, but this is the way we're doing it. Because that's how it works. What's up, Fluffernutter? How you doing? Ad, you can definitely watch now. What up, Bailey? How you doing, bro? Good to see you. Uh, just getting to the top of this uh, thing up here. And we're, we're landing on top of this uh, forge, if that's okay.
Okay. Next time, though. Well, yeah, I hope you're, I hope you're doing good, dude. Welcome on in. Welcome back, brother. Okay. Yeah, meditation's huge, because now if we learned anything, we still have it. This place is looking like a Doctor Who intro. True. Okay, I almost wonder if I want to... Let's see. I want to go do the Tower of Quantum Knowledge shit, too. Back to the hang, the hanging city here. We're gonna wait for the piece of the planet to come apart, and then just dip back in there again. Oh, Charlie, hell yeah! I'm glad you've been liking the YouTube videos. Alyssa, uh, it's complicated in a sense that you don't really know what you're doing. Like you kind of. There's no like linear path. You kind of just figure it out as you go. So it's a lot of just exploring and figuring out, you know. What's up? I guess. Yeah, it's kind. Of, I guess it's kind of like Subnautica. That makes sense. Also, sorry if you got an ad. Fluffer, you can put the stream on your uh, on like an iPhone or an iPad and uh, play The Sims on your PC. That, that, that's what you want to do. What's up, Kay? Yeah, or, a lot of people watch on their TVs or like a second monitor, but if you don't have a second monitor, you know. That's crazy, that's exactly what you're doing, yeah. I'm on your main monitor, dang. I have six copies of your team open on various viewing platforms. I knew you were the GOAT. You only watching your old Game Boy? That's fine. I'm on the Duncan office computer again. Yo, can I get a quick cold brew or what? Where's the where's the little thing that breaks apart? What's up, Chloe? How you doing, dude? What do we owe the pleasure? You watching your smart fridge? No, you don't. Come on. Main monitor Genshin, second monitor Chris. Okay. watching console and chat on mobile oh nice yeah I'll, I'll i'll watch on tv and uh type sometimes on my phone dude a duncan sponsorship would be huge actually i go to duncan every day for the most part where is that hole at that little opening. You're a dunk king, I am. What's up, Colin? How you doing, dude? Maybe I'll text Ben Affleck and see if he's down to uh, give me a sponsorship. Like, hey, man. Just give me free Duncan for a year. They sponsor rivals. That's a good point. They they do a lot. Yeah, I, could, I could also talk to my uh, my manager and be like, yo. Yo. 
Nah, I'm not. I'm not making a weird drink. I'm very like to the point. I'm not like, yo, I need sugar and sweets. The the, the flavor would just be regular. I get mine with uh, the sweet foam and then oat milk. The Melburger being just black coffee doesn't sound uh, doesn't sound good either. There, that doesn't sound like a good uh, thing. I love oat milk, though. You get medium cold brew, a black coffee, and a cig. Oh, shit. Now, yeah, I just couldn't imagine ordering, like, 20 fucking pumps of, like, different things, and I don't know. At that point, it's dessert, and like having dessert in the morning just seems like a weird start to the day. I'm not gonna like roast or hate on it though. Like everyone does their own thing, but I just—I don't think I could have that much sugar. Bro, it's like fuck it, you know. Hmm. Maybe we gotta try a different strap. That would put you to sleep if you had that early in the morning. You used to have a regular who would order a caramel frap at 6 a.m. Yeah, that's wild to me. Yeah, no, I'm going to go to a different... I, I think I'm going to go back to uh, Gabbro. You may have just spilled coffee on your laptop and keyboard. Because of our conversation or separately? Oh, unless you're downloading it, let's go. Separately, I'm sorry, yellow sub. This is making me want coffee. I have I have a little bit of a uh, cold brew left. Okay. There's more to explore here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the construction yard. Dude, I can't, yeah, Addy, I can't believe that was a dr an actual drink. Do I like matcha? I don't, Shan does though. Shan drinks matcha like crazy. She loves it. Construction yard, there we go. It clogged your drains? We have a guy who comes through five times a week at 9 a.m. for a caramel frap. I mean, hey, if it's a guy, he knows what he wants though, so it's like, Good for him, right? I guess. Have I, have I been on top of this thing yet? But a keg likes to make nitro cold brew at home. That's awesome. Ray, that's that sucks. Is it a coffee? Have you considered one or two diet cokes? I have not. My ship's gone. My ship is gone. I'm about to be dead. What is happening? I'm underwater. I think this isn't good. Good. Oh. Okay. Way less damage than I expected, though, which is good. Yeah, that's the that's my one gripe with this game is being able to tell when you're underwater or not. It's like impossible. Statue workshop. Okay, we need to figure out how to get inside here.
I don't know if I've been here yet. Maybe I have. Hmm. Oh, I think I have. We're gonna test the memory statue tonight. Flock says it could be dangerous, so we can't come. But what if we don't use the door and snuck in the other way? Does anyone want to the other way? Flock told us not to do it. Eggs, no way. What the heck? Dude loves Duncan. But that's a huge risk to take. We, we probably shouldn't. Maybe Flocks will see us at the later, later test. Okay, so now we know there's an, a secret entrance. Okay, so this is... Uh, that's the, that's, those are the tornadoes. It's like a tornado emblem. Yo, am I just realizing that like jumping on certain planets is different, like gravity? Like jumping on this planet, I'm not going fucking anywhere. Versus uh, Brittle Hollow, I was fucking goofing around and flopping around. This is like really tough to jump around in. Oh, lower left is his gravity. There you go. There you have it. There you have it. Right there in front of you. Gravity here is two times the strength. My best friend here. Thank you, man. Yo, Babs, have a good one. See you later. Welcome to Giant Steve Friends. I'm excited for you to meet the statues. If I'm not in my dwelling, I'm likely in my workshop below, inside the island. Yeah, so how do I get into there? How do we get into that? There's got to be a secret entrance here. Come on. We're going to find it. We're going to be stoked. This is, I wonder if this is like the entrance and like you need to be standing on it when like a tornado's over you maybe or something? What is all this down here? Ooh, ship log updated. There we go. All right. Probably not good, but also maybe I can enter from underneath here. Perhaps. Yup. Yup. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're cooking. Okay. That's a good thing. Here we go. Okay, now we have that entrance. Is that a grilled cheese with apricot preserves and greens? Uh, yo, those are good. Grilled cheeses with, uh, oh, wait, look at that. When there's a tornado, the fucking uh, ship lights go crazy. I think. Maybe 
maybe it lets you know that there's a tornado currently not. Yeah, no, that's good. If anyone tries to give you shit for having apples on a grilled cheese, they don't get it. Okay, so wait. The, the three eyes, there's a goat, it looks like. That's a statue. That's like a new creature. We don't, I don't even know, I'm not even familiar with what that is. Apples on a grilled cheese with like a brie cheese with like a honey basil. Yo, it's good. Trust. Would you kindly step back so Dad is as close to the statue when pairing? The statue will choose whoever it is in closest proximity. See how its eyes have opened? That tells us the statue is paired with Daz. Now, no matter where he is in his star system, Daz's statue will record his memories and send them to the Ash Twin Project. This is extraordinary sculpting work, Phlox. He's done himself again, hasn't he? And now that we have our first successful pairing, we can test the memory storage prototype. Each statue will send a single nomized memory to his or her own storage with, uh, unit within Ash Twin. Each storage unit will be equipped with a mask, the statue's counterpart, which will be able to send... Yo! So, the, the statue that we have on our own planet is someone's memories, essentially. Uh, that is crazy. Perhaps, perhaps more to it, also. Okay, let's see here. Insert that, spin it around, do a little dance. <laughs> I'm install the mass inside the Ashman Project blocks that look beautiful, although I feel as though I'm being observed. It's comforting to know the statues will not pair until the project succeeds. Otherwise, I imagine the experience would be hard to endure. Ideally, uh, they'll only need to activate once the project succeeds as a safety measure, however. So they're uploading their memories to these statues, I guess, to keep knowledge or something. Why is that? If anything goes wrong with the Ashton Project, the statues and their mass will make us aware of the situation and enable us to fix it. Otherwise, it would be possible for us to remain permanently unaware of the problem. Oh. I hadn't thought of that. What a profoundly horrific fate that would be. Once the project succeeds, that's a safe memory. However, the statues will also activate in the event of equipment failure. Oh, so the event. statues will work regardless. That's kind of scary. So if the, if uh, their plans failed or succeeded, the the statues are still gonna uh, activate, which is very interesting. Okay, now. Okay, so there's a few that are on here and a few that are off. Oh, great. Wait, huh? Why did I fall in water? What up, Mayor? How you doing? Okay, so here's some other statue heads getting carved. They're so cool. The wilds goes. To figure out how to get up there. Hmm. Yeah, the music is so nice. Oh, I could probably bring my ship in here, maybe. Oh, eggs, let's go. Is my ship broken? Is that my ship? No, that, that's something else, I think. What is that? What is this? 
Oh, that is my ship. I think my ship's fucking destroyed. Oops. My ship's gone. Oops. I'm screwed. Okay. Yeah, it just fell off. Oh, you know what I think I have to do here? When the next tornado happens, I need I need to uh, have it lift me up to there. I need to get up there somehow. We'll know when it's happening soon because we'll see it when everything lights up purple. Dang, now I want a grilled cheese. Okay, here we go. It's about to happen, I think. Oh, I'm running out of oxygen. Scrambled eggs with cheese in your stove. Let's go. Okay. I'm gonna try reading all this before I die. Holy shit. I'm curious. Uh, sending a being's memories back in time is the same as sending the being back itself back in time. As an example, if we were to send my memories back in time, is that the same as sending me back? <laughs> Wait. What if we are the Nomai and we forgot? No shot. Imagine there's two different actions. I wouldn't both actions be effectively the same, but isn't the end result identical in either case? Suppose that this was, uh, time was being rewritten. Re re I believe this is different than receiving memories from what is effectively the future. But isn't the end result identical in either case? Bro, that's so interesting. So, they're sending memories back in time. As an example, if we were to send my memories back in, this, in the time, is that the same as sending me back in time? Not my physical body, but my essence. And imagine there's two different actions. Okay, so some shit's happening here. meditate yeah some shit's happening what up 3g okay i was gonna but i felt bad oh which yeah no it's mayor's like one thing that they love to do becca thank you for the sub once again by the way What's up next to nothing? How are you? Okay. So now we have. I wonder if we have, since we have more information uh, about these statues, if we go talk to the one that's over here, if it'll do anything different for us. Chip log. Okay. So we, okay. So now these are connected. Every memory recorded by a Know My Statue is transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within Ash Twin. Okay, so we need to get to Ash Twin to get all their memories as well. Maybe that's where we go instead. We just go to Ash Twin. Okay. What's up, Sweet Revenge? Yo, what up, Shock Noble? How you doing, dude? 
the four months, man. It's Giants Deep. Dark Bramble. Hollow's Lantern. No. Thank you for the resub. We get some LFGs in the chat, guys, for all the resubs we got here. What is up, dude? Not much, man. Just find, uh, just found out some cool shit about uh, the statues that these guys have been using. I'm gonna not autopilot this. I'm about to die to this fucking sun. Twin, Ash Twin. Come on. Oh yeah, the teas are really good. Rest in Peach is one of my favorite ones. I love the wilds that are outer. Drink that one right now? Yeah, it's my favorite one. It's so good. Okay. how this one works. Okay. What's up, son? There's the quoom. How to delete chat message. I'll simply not read it if that helps. Kush, you and Shock have similar uh, color schemes going on here. Oh, that's sand. That's bad. That's bad. That's a sand uh, storm. Booligan, let's go. Hell yeah. They're fun hats, right? Oh, wait. This place? Look at this. As the game goes on, the sand goes lower. Whoa. Scout, I, I made a... Uh, I made a Stardew Valley channel on Discord because I was so hyped. Sometimes it, it, sometimes you forget what color your uh, your username is because you're like streaming all the time. Uh, I was not planning on it. 3G. I don't even know what it's uh, like what they're expecting, but is there any like is there any rumors or any leaks or anything that people are like anticipating? You're the vinyl soundtrack. Oh, let's go, Carly. Uh, Eggs got hers today too. You and Eggs are both. Uh, Outer Wilds Vinyl Girlies. If they fuck up Gen 5, I'm done with Pokemon, I think. Okay, hopefully this, uh, let me go in here. Yes. We're so, we're so fine in here. You're going to the, uh, starting concert next week? Yo, I've heard really good things. Really good things. Who float? Wait, that's funny.
So, so you have to like wait for the sand to just slowly go away on this planet to do stuff. It's a good suggestion, Vic. Uh, I might do a quick BRB. I might go get some, make some coffee and uh, go to the bathroom real quick. If CA is there, I will request his blessing to develop Juni mobile car on my own. Oh, that'd be f something. Do you think he, does, does he go to all of them? That, that's wild to think about if he goes to all, like, all the shows. He's probably so hype about it. Let's see here. What's up, shrimp? How you doing? He went to his first view. All right, be right back, guys. Enjoy this. I'm going to stand up real quick, guys. Say hi to everybody. Oh, she's vibing. She is vibing. Stand up here for a second. 
You want to get out here? Go. Oh, get out of here. There she goes. We love her. She's great. Okay. to the grind how old is she she's 13 turning 14 this year dude um yo miramar thanks for the 29 months appreciate that shock thanks again for the four dude tell me about my hat i bought it in vermont i thought it looked cool and i liked i liked what it was made of so i just bought it Your parents have a 22-year-old cat? That's what's up. Okay. She'll soon be paying taxes. Yeah, that's the plan. We were just talking to someone the other day about how Vermont doesn't seem like a real place. Dude, Burlington is awesome. I was there and I wasn't uh, I wasn't expecting much and I was like, this is a, just a fun little vibe. It was cool. Why aren't pets dependents? Three minutes of auction remaining. Okay, I need to get near something here. Ooh, what's this? Friends visiting from the Hanging City, we were planning the Ash Twin project at the High Energy Lab on the Ember Twin. I became lost in Ember Twin. My gratitude that Rami, Rami found me. But the High Energy Lab is the building with the large solar panels. I'm surprised I didn't see it. I imagine our uh, otherwise immen immensely clever Con Conoy will lose his own head if it weren't, if it weren't uh, anatomically impossible. Okay. Okay, so more sand is dropping. Oh, there's a dead guy. There's a dead guy right there. Vermont is... Eh, Vermont's like a little... Honestly, Vermont, I would say, is the closest to... Um, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's not good. Oh, fuck. We're going... We're, we're, we're gone. I would say Vermont's more like timber or earth. Bro, it's like, fuck you. All that waiting for, for I'm pretty sure, nothing now. Burlington, I think it'd be the same vibes. Nice. I'm gonna go try finding a, a forest to stand in. I've never been to Ithaca before. Oh, there's my ship. Here we go. O2 is fueling right now, which is good. What's up, Reaper? How are you? Oh, the gravity here is zero sometimes. That's awesome. Getting in my ship would be huge right now. What is that floating thing? Huh. I think it's a part of that ship we see floating around.
What is the big rotating device or what was it the Nomai were observing? I'd po pose it. I'd pose it that there's something special about the orange symbol on that device. How on the new uh, uh, astronauts? Translator tool would be nice to have handy about now. The orange device. Let's see where that is. Oh, this thing. So everything is blue, or everything's purple, but this one is orange for some reason. This planet sometimes and only sometimes has a moon. This is also of note. It, appear, it disappears if no one is watching it. Isn't that a fascinating orbital characteristic? What's up, Macau? How you doing? Give me reluctance to move while uh, consciously observed. It might be a form of m macroscopic quantum mechanics. I agree. Our first step would be determining a method to track this phantom moon so that we could always know where it is. I found your note, Melore. Kindly count me among this moon's admirers. What is happening when it disappears? I doubt it ceases to exist. Does it move to another location? I believe so. Not only does the moon appear around Brittle Hollow, I can confirm it sometimes orbits Timber Hearth as well. Okay. I think I did this already last time I played this, but we're running back. Drop this. Remove this. Boom. The quantum moon locator is functioning. We have markers for each of the places the moon goes. Anona, Burr, I just observed the quantum moon is in orbit around Dark Bramble. I added a dark, I added a marker for Dark Bramble. I thought the locator now accounted for all the phantom moon's locations, but sometimes the locator can't tell where the moon is. Perhaps there's a problem with the device. It's also possible there exists a sixth place in the star system to which the phantom moon travels. You have keen eyes, my friend. So this moon travels to a total of five locations, not four. Okay, ship log updated, that's good. We're learning stuff. This music sometimes when it starts, it sounds like a uh, childish Gambinos. I wanted you to know for me I ready to go my heartbeat, my heartbeat. Like the little piano that plays. <laughs> Bro, I don't know why it sounds almost exactly like that. Ooh, I need to use this to launch myself up. I think. That's what we're doing here. Yeah, he's uh, he's in the Discord call with us. He says what up. Shuttle is currently resting at the comet. Call the shuttle home. Okay, cool. Alright, we're running out of fuel. I fear our situation may be dire. Pi, Poke, and I landed on here uh, th on this comet not long after its arrival in the star system. Our shuttles, equipment, Heard strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Pine Poke were able to locate a fissure in the ice in the comet's sunward side, and they descended into the to investigate the source of the readings. But Pi and my sister have been gone for a long time now. They haven't contacted me since descending below the surface either. Should I leave the shuttle to look for them? I want to follow protocol, but I don't know what I'll do if they aren't well. Poke Pi, come back to me safely, my friends. Dang. Yeah, we, I think we read that last time too. That's very sad. He doesn't want to, he doesn't want to lose his pals. Let's see, we go this way. Dare comedy. Now that is a throwback. Okay, we're about to be inside the sun, which is not good. Okay. You're gonna go on a walk, have fun. Ooh, 
Ooh, that's not what we were trying to do. That's okay, though. Yeah, Groot, for me, uh, it, it's good neighbor stuff. That's like the the one sketch group that I constantly quote. And then recently, I think you should leave. Okay, we're about to die in space, I think. But good neighbor's like so funny. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna meditate until the next loop. I think we have a lot of good new stuff that we found. And yeah, Mayor, enjoy your walk. Miramar, thank you for the reso also. Bro, I thought Kyle was so funny on um on SNL, but he wasn't utilized well enough. Yo, really? The egg game? I'm seeing I'm seeing Tim Robinson live uh, next month in New York City, and I actually can't wait. We got sloppy steaks uh, for his discovery for uh, Infinite Craft, which was one of my proudest achievements. Yeah, I'm, I'm super stoked. I'm definitely going to be fangirling. Six location. Okay, so then now there's a six location that we potentially know about, which is interesting. Okay, um, let's see. Construction. So it still says there's more to to, to explore here. Statue workshop. The statues are designed to only activate once the tw uh, Ash Twin project succeeded, or in the event that it failed. Okay, so that's both options. The construction... Oh, construction yard's different from Statue Island. Okay. Let's go to the construction yard, maybe, and see what's going on here. Carly, so to be fair, um... Eggs in chat told me, uh, she was like, this isn't really a spoiler, but you should probably do this. Just because, like, I was doing a lot of, like, uh, runs where I would just die and reset. Let's go see if we get whistled at. Oh my god. Um, so that was that was the one thing that someone helped me with. They were like, "This will this will save you a lot of like time, and also you won't get, uh, you know, you won't lose progress if you restart." I kind of want to. I kind of want to land on this thing. Yo, listen, thanks for the seven months. Appreciate that, dude. Welcome, welcome. Thank you very much. How you doing, Madison? What's up, big country? How you doing, man? Oh, shit. Oops. Okay. There we go. Is that where I'm supposed to be going right there? construction spot? I think it might be. You said a sip of water? Yo, dang. No, this is, this is the other island, I think. Yeah, construction yards all the way over there, bro. Yeah, the game's cool, Big Country. It's definitely it's one of those games where like you have to use your brain a little bit. Uh, it's fun. It's a lot of just exploring and 
after this time. A lot of people who I respect, like a lot of people who I feel like have good takes and good taste in games, really love this one. So, I don't know if that helps or not, but I've been, I've been enjoying it. What's that? That's someone else's ship, I think. Whose ship is this? Well, that's yours? I'm just one fan, what can I say? That's someone else's ship that looks exactly like mine, which is interesting. There's oh, what the fuck? This thing's floating in the air, goddammit. Oh my god, it's outside. And now it's going back down. Let me just land on it real quick, if that's okay. Ah, fuck me. Hold on. Fuck you. I think I'm on it, though. Oh my god, we are on it somehow. We are underwater, though, which is not good. Mobile sucks. Yeah, mobile's trash. Ruthie, thank you for the two years. Let's go. A two-year celebration. Like, I, I watch a mobile a lot, but the experience isn't the best sometimes. Not, not, not like knocking anyone on mobile, you know? Okay, so there's more to do here. That's what they're saying. Construction yard. Bro, do I have to wait for it to go in the air again to do anything? Is that like, what, like another one of those, like we have to just wait kind of vibes? Dude, I heard Helldivers is a blast. My buddy, um, my buddy John was playing last night. He was like, dude, it's like a really fun game to just blast, like, blast enemies with your friends for a few hours. You got a blue burger now. It looks great. Helldivers 2 is kind of for the boys. Yeah, it looks cool. I'd like to play it with some friends. I just don't know, uh... Like where to start or who even would like be down or if it'd even be like a good stream game or not, but it looks fun Okay, there's another one of those Six minutes 19 seconds ago long-range probe successfully launched from the orbital probe cannon We're lifting orbital probe cannon components into uh, orbit for assembly and the one somehow sank down beneath the current uh, Kasava convinced me not to try to recreate the phenomenon myself other than uh cannon parts, but we're very curious to know what happened. How could something pass through the current? My gratitude for your interesting question. This is exciting. Spire constructed a model of Giant's Deep here at Brittle Hollow's Southern Observatory and revealed how an object might sink below the current. Conway, I'm unable to grasp the answer by looking through the projection pool. If I visit the observatory, would you kindly explain? If you don't mind the trek beneath the surface to the South Pole, I'd be delighted to see you. There are two trailheads, one at Brittle Hollow's Gravity Canyon and one at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Okay, so it wants me to go to Riddle Hollow, it seems like, to maybe see these dudes. Or to, to get past a current or some shit. Yeah, th this is, this this is what's gonna help us get, I think. Okay, so th is this, we, 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 this, we've been here before, this is the uh, fucking, Model of Helm uh, of Giant I was at Helm too, Giant Steep here, Fiddle Hollows Southern Observatory. Okay, so they want us to go to Brittle's Hollow for uh, to maybe learn some shit. What's up, Bobby? Oh wait, is this? Hmm. 
Bobby fucking Bam on Spotify. So this is what we're on, I guess. This is it. We finished building the final orbital probe cannon module and are, uh, are ready to send into orbit around Giants Deep for assembly. That's the thing that's floating around that's broken, I think. Our next step will be to send Privet up to the orbital probe cannon to install the probe tracking system. To all my friends here at the construction yard, my gratitude for your tireless work. I'd given up hope, but I truly believe this cannon may actually succeed where many others have not. By now, my brother Avens and his spouse will want to launch the probe with as much power as possible. I'm worried the cannon would break under the strain. It did break. It's broke as fuck. I propose we give Avon and Mallow a slightly lower maximum power setting than the absolute maximum po possible to create room for their enthusiasm. Are you going... Uh, Gelatinous on us, love. I'm delighted by your words, but they're atypical for you. If I'm ever half as gooey as Malo and even behave together, Daz, you may launch me from the orbital probe cannon. Ooh, a lot of dead uh, bodies here. Not good. Hmm. What's up, Ricky? How are you? Okay, so it seems like whatever they tried doing failed. But the one guy, the one guy had it, like knew it was gonna fail. So what the fuck? That's broken, so I don't go that way. But also, did it fail? Like, is there a way for me to maybe remedy it? Let's go back over here real quick. I'm gonna go read this shit one more time as well. Okay. Coney Dice and I were lifting orbital probe cannon components into orbit for assembly, and one somehow sank down beneath the current. Okay. You should have seen it. We thought it was impossible for any cannon components to sink even partially below the current, but ours sank straight to the core, the core of this planet. Convinced me to not try to recreate the phenomenon myself using other cannon parts, but we're very curious to know what happened. How could something pass through the current? So could I maybe use one of these pieces to get into, oh my God, maybe one of the things that's floating, or that's that's broken, I wonder if I can use it to get to the uh, inside of the core here, or something fucked up, perhaps, since they that's what they just told us. I'm able to grasp the answer by looking through the projection pool, if I could uh, visit the observatory, would you kindly explain? Okay, so that's interesting. So if we can get to the pieces that are floating around outside this planet, somehow uh, push one into the planet and go below to the core, that might be something worth investigating. There's my ship. Okay. We're also about to go in the air, I think, which is good. stand on this for when we, uh, I think, go into space. Go. Now we're in space. Oh, fuck. Okay. There's definitely a place to go here, I feel like. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, my f oh it's too late. Too late. Bro, the silence of space is so cool there. That was so fucking cool when you went flying in the air for a split second like that. Yeah, we may be gaming. We may be gaming. Yeah, the ship is somehow just chilling up there. I don't know what's going on, but I'm down. I'm down with it. Yeah, it's just chilling.
Okay, so that's that's the core that you can't get through, the current you can't pass. I think what we're going to do is meditate until the next loop. Just got back from the store and got the most beautiful onion. Farmer popped off with this one for real. Ruthie, thanks again for the two years. Let's go, Arena. Thanks for the two years also. Two years back to back. Guys, thanks. I grow your own onions and harvest time is the best. Dude, yeah. A fresh onion from your garden is, is, is the best. Onions, garlic, and uh, broccoli. Yup. All right. Let's run it. My shirt looks like an Omai? Thanks. I wasn't even planning that. Every cuisine uses onions when you think about it. True. Or you can enhance the flavors with it. Okay. Ocean Discovery. Let's 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 read this real quick. Let's read this shit. The Nomai at the Southern Observatory constructed a model of Giant's Deep that revealed how an object might sink below the strong current. Okay, so I kind of want to get on. To, like, we got to figure out a way to get onto the. Um, a gar yeah, a garden fresh tomato. So it's got to be like the cherry ones though. The cherry tomatoes, fresh off the vine are so, they're like candy. Literally like candy. No, not, it's gotta be, it's gotta be, for me, for me, it's gotta be the little cherry one. Cause the big ones are great, don't get me wrong, but you you gotta like prepare, like just taking a bite out of it. It's like, I don't know. Okay, let me, let me go get that. I'm all, I think I'm also just like cherry tomato main. Or grape tomato, man, I guess. Yeah, I know. I know people do the slices with the salt. I can't. I, can, I a big a big a tomato slice though with like tuna. And uh, cheddar cheese. Now that's what we're talking about. Part of the uh, like, what garden zone are you in? Yo, what up, Chicos? One sec. Zone B six. Okay, we're in zone six, I think. I'm so close to getting on this fucking thing. Come on. Yes. Yes. No, 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 no. No. Fuck off. Go down. Okay, I've been here before, I think. We've been here before. But now that, now that we know that um, a piece of this can go into the core, we might want to try launching ourselves into uh, the planet. We've been here before, but we didn't really know as much. What is this? Is that a fucking bramble fucking seed? What's going on in here?
No, never mind. Oh, no, that's the thing that's broken. Okay. Oh, you can see where that shit broke in there. Oh, dang. Okay, that's not a bramble seed. Those are those tubes with the marbles. Ow. Okay. No, don't go that way. That, that shit's broken also over there. And there's that's where it came from. And then... Or is this where it came from? No, that's where it came from. Okay. Definitely something to do here. So Got to figure out what. Okay. Oh, this fucking place. Okay. New music. Launch module projection stone. Okay, so this is where everything's floating around, not looking good. Great. Maybe we'll re read some notes about what happened here. My, be my better 50% Casa Cassava is sending the last of the cannon components, soon relatively speaking. We know the eye's precise location. The thought of concluding our elders' curious and challenging search increases my heart's temperature, my love. Kasava tells me and the construction yard crew of the tournament of power setting we are not under any circumstances to go above. I see. Am I right to think that, consequently, we'll be ignoring that setting? I can post it that uh, with nearly 100% certainty our friends have accounted for our nature, so I suggest we do. Giving the orbital probe cannon all the power it can structurally withstand creates the greatest chance of finding the eye of the universe. And that's where they fucked up. Yes. Okay, yo, big country. Sounds good, man. We won't. The probe must travel as fast as it can, as far as it can. It'll make. I'll just make some adjustments. And that's where they fucked it all up. Now, here's the giant deep's pro uh, projection stone. Let's see what they're, what they're saying over here. I have bad news, Avens. Yarrow says there was a problem with the proposed power source, so the orbital probe cannon won't be asked to fire. I hope you're pulling my locomotive limb here, Kasava. Kasava. I wish I were my friend, but no, they aren't certain they can fix the problem, so the orbital probe cannon is on an indefinite hiatus. Tell Privet and Molly they should return from the cannon. My spouse and I will remain on the construction yard for now. And update, okay, Molly and I will join you and Daz. Privet left to visit her brother. She fears Idea may feel responsible. Okay. Here's a projection zone for Giants Deep. We know this place. Okay, this is. Oh, that's how you do that. Okay. Damage report several structural stress detected. Assessing damage to modules. Intact, no structural damage. Viewport window fractured, module exposed to vacuum of space. Probe tracking module missing. Okay. I wonder if I can find out if one of these things is good enough to maybe try taking to the core or something. Like, whatever one's in the best condition to try to... I don't know. Launch request received. Probe launch successful. Data from the probe. Structural uh, com compromise during launch. Damage to multiple modules detected. Okay, so that's that one. Now this. What's up, Lacey? How are you? Danny, I'm sure uh, Book Club has a bunch of books I could recommend. Okay. 
Cannon align with randomly selected probe trajectory. Gravity field activated. Interesting indeed. I wonder if I should go. Oops. Probe tracking module. Let's see. So that's broken over there. Hmm. This is also like broken over here. I want to get over there and see what the vibe is. Yeah. It is interesting, but I don't know how to get over there. That's the ish. Unless we go up here and then around, maybe? Oop. Definitely something going on over there. Now where the fuck am I? Oh, we're back here again. No, I don't I don't wanna go here. Maybe I'll go up to my ship and then the dip. Ships over here? Shit. Ha! <laughs> Sorry, Podgy. That, do that does happen. Ow. Land in that game though, tears is like 100 plus hours, man. Fuel level critical. I need to go on, go on here real quick and. Okay. Okay, let's refuel. Let's check my log, see if I got anything new. Nope. Okay. Ask me a leading question, sure. Don't know what the projection stones do? Yeah, they uh, show me. Sp they show me places. Is it like an astral projection or is it like the actual like shit that it's showing me? Yeah, 
It's the actual shit. Okay, what up, Tony? How you doing? Oh, so you know what's interesting then? Can I put like this giant deep stone with one of these things above me? No, okay. the launch module project projection stone. Just did your nails feeling cute, okay. Okay, so this is the broken area. Oh. Okay, so that's where I shot my, um, okay. That's where I shot my thing from before. Let's see. I wonder if I if I go back over there real quick, shoot my my little dude through the hole again, and then do the projection stone and see what happens. I'm curious if I can interact with my guy or something. Now we can. Now we know that that's over there. Uh, I can go this way. No, I go this way. The bramble stuff scares you if you're being honest. It's, yeah, it's weird. It's cool though, as well. That's not the correct way. That shit's busted. That shit's busted. Go this way. Yeah. <clears throat> Back. So let me check this again. So there's my scout right there. Okay, so this is. Yeah, no, it's, there's definitely something interesting there. So I want to, I, I can explore this area more. Yeah, my little guy's right there, yeah. I see him. Doing a good job. So you can only you could only go like a little bit. Like you can't go too far or else you get. Like once you get there, then you're screwed. Dizzy, this guy is. Okay. Okay, 
I'm gonna I'm gonna go through this uh, broken tunnel and then scoot on over hopefully to the other area maybe and see what the vibe is. Where's my scout at? There he is. Focus on the mission. Okay. Go through this little crack right here, buddy. Fuck you. Okay. Cool. Fuck up. Sit down. Sit. Oh, I need to go sit down here. Okay. There we go. Okay. Imagine Privet, the probe tracking module would be the first to know the coordinates of the eye of the universe. You'd be the first to see them. I am honored and terrified. You won't ask the orbital probe can to use so much power that it breaks, will you? Fret not, my nervous friend. We only need to fire the probe once anyway, so who minds if it compromises uh, the orbital probe cannon's structural integrity slightly? I would mind, Mallow. I would mind because it, we won't be capable of receiving our probe's data if the probe tracking module is destroyed. And that's... Ooh, control module stone. Is that, is that the one that we, do, we already know about? I think it is. Oh, it's new. <laughs> Mal, my better 50%. Cassava Kas is sending the last of the cannon components. Soon, relatively speaking, we'll know the eye's precise location. I thought of concluding our elders' curious and challenging search, increasing my heart's temperature. Oh, I think we already read all this. Yeah, I already read all that. Okay. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> That's fun. Okay. Let's see what this looks like over here now. Ooh. Now this is where the probe launch coordinate shit is. There's a fucking face over here as well. Oh, is this in the tower? Or is this in Dark Bramble? No, or is this in the fucking uh, Giant's Deep in the fucking... Where is this? This is somewhere. This is somewhere. It looks like it could be in the tower, maybe. Hey. That's that's interesting. Or is it the past? Ooh, maybe it's the past, bro. Nah, come on, shut up. We got the music playing. So it looks like this, but this looks like shit now. Oh, the sun's about to explode. Where should we watch it? Is it the Quoom? The best and worst jam. Yep. Let's go. Let's go watch this fucking thing explode, huh? Now we're gonna die before it happens. What are you gonna do? It's, it's, it's gorgeous. 
Ooh, that was creepy. That was creepy and weird. Song slaps. Okay. We learned a good amount. We need to get to wherever that fucking room is. Uh, and see what's up. And that room is either... I need to get to the quantum tower. I need to figure out how to get to the quantum tower. Yeah, Bruce, the, the soundtrack is so good. What up, Nar? <sighs> the room that had uh, the the statue, and it was, like, not broken. That room. The Quower. The quantum tower. The DLC soundtrack's 11 out of 10, though. Oh, dang. Okay, let's see here. Let's go to the ship log. Okay, now we know the launch module. Let's go into here. Yeah, the gasp is a little much, but I like it. Okay, let's go to map mode. Giant's Deep. Quantum signal. The, the Nomai detected a quantum signal from somewhere on Giant's Deep. <coughs> The Nomai in the construction yard say something sank beneath... Oh, wait. Don't I have to maybe talk to someone about that? Like, there's a chance to get it... Un like, should, I talk should I go talk to Gabro, maybe? About uh, stuff going in there and see what his vibes are? One of the uh, orbital probe cannons, three modules. The a Nomai computer reports the probe tracking module is missing. I saw the probe tracking module through a Nomai projection pool. It looks like the module is underwater. Yes. Okay, so it's underwater... Definitely uh, uh, at Giant's Deep, I think. Yo, what up, Eric? How you doing, dude? Okay, so let's go to Giant's Deep and fucking try something here, huh? The orbital probe cannon. Yup. Engage autopilot. <laughs> bunch of yaplets over here. Bunch of yapperoni and cheese. Okay. The orbital probe can. So that's the thing that... That's that right there. How it goes exploring, it is going. It is indeed going. We do know that there is a uh, piece of this cannon... Uh, in the, I think in this area. I'm gonna go talk to Gabro real quick. Let's see what his vibes are. Yeah, that, that's gotta be where he's at, right? Oh. Now. Okay. Yeah, the water just feels kind of nice. It, it tickles you a little bit. Oh, God. Oh, shit. We are floating. I'm in a, tr I'm in a tree. So these little t uh, tornado things keep you from, like, moving, I think. That's, like, their whole purpose. When the tornado's active. That's pretty cool. I fuck with that. Okay. I don't know how to get to Gaparo, though. We're going to have to go back to the ship and fix it real quick. What's up, Lou Bun? Ever seen a tornado? I actually haven't. You know what? Maybe I've seen like a baby one before, but not one that was like super scary. Gravity's so bad here. Ah, 
on, you fuck. Oh my god. You watch them from your porch? Sheesh. Pros off to see the wizard. Gabro. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, my, oh, his island was just floating. I think hurricanes have like crazier. What is this? That's the workshop game. I think uh, tornadoes have like the, the shape that's a little freaky, but hurricanes are like stronger, I think. Maybe I don't know. Like, I, if I saw it, I think I'd be more scared to see a tornado, but I think a hurricane could do more damage, or maybe I don't know anything. Yeah, like they, they look freaky. Like you can see, like the fact that you can see like a tunnel, you know, spinning around, like that's wild. But hurricanes are just strong as fuck and just pick up and destroy anything on its path. Tsunami though, don't don't even get me start uh, start with a tsunami, you know. I found something. I reached the inside of Statue Island. So the Nomai, the Nomai created those head statues to record memories, huh? Yeah, I could see the Nomai doing that. Not sure for what, but it seems like they're sort of thing. Do you think the statues are recording our memories then? Because I remember that on the beach. That one on the beach looked at me funny. That must be my memory friend. Ooh. I found what happened to the orbital probe cannon. Whoa, so... Whoa, that's the cannon breaking apart at the start of each time loop. For real. Oh, that's the thing that keeps breaking apart. Ooh. Wait. So, the loop and the breaking of the orbital cannon are connected... Something's fishy. What's the cannon breaking apart of this? Uh, yeah. Can you figure out why? Too much power or over enthusiasm? I'm gonna go too much power. It's kind of scary how much that sounds like something uh, Slater Feldspar would do. I'm pretty surprised the Nomai built something that actually broke. Come think of it, though, broke might be the wrong word because it looks like the orbital probe cannon is still firing successfully at the beginning of each time loop. Okay. That is interesting. I found your ship. Oh, cool. So it's floating in the ocean, huh? It looked like it was having a good time. Where should I explore in Giant Sea? Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I see a bright flash in the side. Something must be happening up there in Norway or on the planet. What else have you been? Statue Island? Yeah, I've been doing that. Okay. See you later. Cool. So now we have... That's the thing that I, uh, that I wanted to go towards, like, initially, but I wasn't sure, like... Uh... That made sense. Okay, maybe I'll just restart and then we'll just try try getting to it right now. I wish I I wish I woke up somewhere else and not by the fire. You feel me? Cause it blasts something and then it breaks apart. She probed my cannon to like quoom. That's a first time sentence right there. Okay, let's see where this goes. So it breaks apart and then it goes somewhere. Okay, we just gotta we just gotta follow it immediately. Go, 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 go. Hurry. Oh my god.
gotta go. Oh man, I have no fucking clue where that thing went. Yeah, right. Oh, is that right there? I'm just gonna hope that's it right there. So far from anything, man. Uh, Mayor, balls for you and K Freckles sent it to me. Oh, yo, Eric, someone sent me this. In honor of us uh, losing our minds on our wiki speed runs. Hell yeah. Bro. I'm restarting again. There's got to be a way to get this thing, like, in immediately. That's where you get your gas. I get my gas from uh, fast food places typically, but you know, to each their own. Okay. They do have good restrooms. I will give you that. Okay, so it's, it's going behind me, going behind me, going behind me, going behind me. Oh, no, Mario, that was a joke. It was a fart, it was a fart joke. No, I spent Wawa now. I need to get to this fucking thing. I can't, I, it's like hard to tell if it's like far as fuck or if it's close. Like I have no idea. Yeah, I mean, no, I was going far, but the thing, like, it, it looks like it's just constantly, like, bouncing around. I can't, like, it, it's, it looks like it's just moving all over the place. When, yeah, chicken, that's what I was, that's what I figured. I think you have to just, like, get to it, like, you have to go exactly where it's, where you, where you think it's going, like, as fast as possible to catch it. Almost like a fucking baseball. <clears throat> Okay, so now it's going. Yeah, I can't. I can't even tell where it's going. <clears throat> so, Madeline, how you doing, dude? I've been a Slurpee gal lately. 
from uh, 7-Eleven or what's up? It bounced into me. Okay, I'm going towards it again. Over here. I think eventually it's going to slow down and, like, chill, maybe. That's the vibe we're looking for here. There it is again. Okay. It's going so fast. Huh? goes back into like the fuck am I supposed to get that? I gotta try again. Thing goes so far. So fast. We go again. There's definitely some sort of like way to catch it, I think. Okay, now it's going behind me. I can't tag it, I don't think. I've been trying to. It seems like it comes back at some point, which is interesting. So I wonder if I just like chill, if it'll come back. We take Bikini Bottom and push it somewhere else. No, I don't want to. No, I don't want to be in cockpit view. Fuck off! Oh my god, this game's bugged. I don't want to be in cockpit view. Get out of here. Bro, fuck this. My game's my game's bugged right now. It's not letting me get out of cockpit view, dude.
Nope, Square's doing nothing. I can't even press start. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. That was annoying. Yeah, I, th I think we're going to, instead of chasing it all the way to the, uh, into the nether, I think I'm going to, like, get close to it and wait for it to come back my way and try to grab it, perhaps. Or something. Because trying to ma match velocity and all that is just not working. Oh, oh what the fuck? Why is it going that way now? Huh? Now it's gone. Now it's fucking gone, man. It's like you have like one. Oh, I was in, I was in autopilot. That's why. Uh, that's why. Dang. Let me go again. I don't know why it keeps going to autopilot. I don't think I'm able to match velocity with it. I'll try to, but it doesn't let me, like, lock onto it. Okay. That's cool, free looking. No. Give me the fucking... Oh, come on. It gave me, like, the, uh... Wait, the ability to lock onto it for, like, a second there. Now it's gone. Bro. Okay. We know that it's possible. We know that it's possible, but, uh... We, we, you're given, like, a second or two to lock onto it. <clears throat> Yo, Vargy, thanks for the uh, 41 months. Oh, happy B-Day as well. If we have some B-Day Garys in the chat. 
the 25th B-Day right there. Let's go, dude. Okay. Feels birthday, man. Okay, so now we know that uh, once it comes back to us, we can snag it. There it is. I gave birth in this day too, so what up to your mother or whatever. There you go. Birthday, birthday pals. Giving birth is giving birth is crazy actually. Kind of kind of wild, right? Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Bro, eat me, rat man. Now it's going to the left. It's weird that it goes to a different spot every time. And there's the quoom. It's very, very interesting that every single time it goes to a different spot. It's almost like each day is different. You know what I mean? Like, what's that mean? What's that all about? Each day is a new possibility, perhaps. A few meta. A, oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on, bitch. We caught it. Come on, fuckface. Understand. Okay, velocity matched. Hold on. Okay. Now let's go straight in.
Bro, I'm pressing X and it's not holding. Dude. I'm pressing X and it's, there we go. It was like shooting a fucking... Am I dead? Am I dead or am I alive? Hold. Hold. Ooh, what is that? That's a, that's the fucking eye, maybe? Okay, how do I do anything on this fucking thing? Please, before I fucking die out here, just give me some fucking help! Please! Let me just get inside of it or something. Please, dick face. What is this, ass? Oh my god. What the fuck is this? What is this fucking thing? do anything on here. Okay. Eggs, what do you mean, Chris, please? What am I supposed to fucking do with this? Useless space junk. But it, it is interesting how it um, happens every day. Okay, I'm just going to die out here. I will say I've never seen anyone interact with this. Gumbo, or whatever the fuck his name was, Garbo, told me to. So I did. And then there was nothing there. Yeah, he said... He said, maybe investigate the thing that b blows apart every fucking day. He said that. With his flesh. He said, he, he said fucking investigate the thing that blows apart every goddamn day. And then I saw I fucking did. And it was nothing. And I wasted an hour fucking doing that. I'm going back to Brittle fucking Hollow. Here we go. There's still more stuff to do here. This is the one. Okay, so now we know that the thing that breaks apart that I tried going for in my first playthrough uh, doesn't actually do anything. Okay. Here we go.
Uh, Bobby, yeah, I would love to. Just let me, uh, scoot through here real quick. Get past this. Go this way. Okay, go over here. Dang, Kush went back to the classic yellow. Oops. No dick! Ugh, I hate the fucking black hole. Can I go back? Can I go through back through here or no? Let's see. No, but it's a one way. <clears throat> if we did go back to Gumbo, we probably could and be like, hey, it was nothing, by the way. And then he'll go, oh, yeah, I know. I, I, I tried it too. Okay. Gumbo's your favorite character? He's chilling. He's a vibe guy. Give Gumbo a piece of her mind. Yeah, Witchy used to be pink. Now they're going for a purple vibe. Very interesting. Okay. Here's my ship logs. We need, I think we need more from this zone. This is all I got. Uh, no, Bobby. No. I, w I want to learn on my own. We're doing just fine. Okay. I need to get I need to get to the tower of quantum knowledge over here. That's a big part, I think. Would I rather explore space or explore the ocean? Um Space, I think. Like, the ocean's cool, but... I don't know. I think space is probably cooler. Okay. I've already been there, I think. Yeah, you could die very easily in both, which definitely sucks. What is this, again? This is something. Oh, that's one. That's one of the escape pods. Okay. I need to find the, the the crack that opens up. Go hollow. There's more space than ocean, true. Oh yeah, Tony, it would definitely be a little like what the fuck vibes. Here we go. This is what we're this is what we're talking about. But we need to not get to the black hole this time somehow. Shit. Here we go. Perfect. No 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 no. Okay. Ow, what the fuck? Oh, I'm not wearing my suit. I'm not wearing my suit? 
I just put it on, dick. This game sucks. This game sucks. <laughs> we go again. We go again. Yeah, that was a dying sound. Yeah, I, I uh, couldn't breathe in space and died. Yeah. Where's Bramble at? Where's... Hold on. There it is. That's not where... No, not Hollow's Lantern. Where's the other one? Is it Hollow's Lantern? Am I high? Maybe it is. No, Brutal Hollow. There we go. It's one of them. Little Pat, thank you, Patty. Okay, we're going. Good night, Aubrey. Thanks for hanging. Yo, Matt, thanks for 22, by the way, as well. Okay. mode let's get a uh... get back in there where wherever that hole is Uh, there's yeah, there's no no cutscenes really, just talking to people. Just talking and vibing. We 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 know a little bit about the fish planet, but we don't know uh, like a ton of, about it yet. We know a little though. We know the inside of it is uh, bigger than the outside, which is interesting. Okay, here we go. We're back. Okay, that's good. Let me put on my fucking outfit this time and not die. Okay. Okay, we need to figure out this spot. So I want to I go up top there again. There's definitely a way to do it correctly. But we're going to do it a little different again. Okay. Fuck! This fucking game. This fucking game. Okay. We did it before. We'll do it again. I'm gonna go heal real quick. Yeah, no, eggs. We literally did it before and it worked. Tony, yeah, you, you gotta like, it's it's weird, but once you get to the top, then it gets a little tricky. But we did get up there and it was pretty cool, so we're gonna try again.
Okay. This is really good. This is really good for us. Okay. Yes! Let's fucking go, baby. We're back. <laughs> okay. Now I can't jump. That's the one thing I have to remember, because I jumped last time. Black Hole Forge, 30 in. Okay. Okay. Exit to the surface. Okay. Wait, what is that? Okay, so that, that brings you to the surface. I don't want to do that yet, I don't think. Or do I? Egg slash Bobby. Do I go through this or not yet? Cat vomit. Uh, I don't... I'm not really that upset. Like, I do, I do sometimes get a little, like, annoyed at things, though. I do not. Okay, cool. Perfect. Good to know, sir. Okay. How the fuck? Oh, my God. Okay. That was scary. <clears throat> Is there anything cool over here? No. Yeah. No, so I got up here before, like an, like a few hours ago. And um and I jumped, not realizing it, and I freaking died. And I fell back down. Okay. You did the same thing? Okay. What's up, Eric? Okay, now what? I'm a little delayed, but what the fuck? <laughs> so, do I jump? Do I jump here or, or not really? Okay. Okay, cool. Okay, now we're chilling. Cool, 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 cool. Wait! Is this the room? Is this the room that we saw in our vision? That's pretty cool that we got here. Okay. Where am I? Where am I talking? Uh, where am I taking this first black hole core? And where am I taking the remaining cores that they're ready? All the warp towers are being constructed on Ash Twins, so the black hole cores will go there. My gratitude in that case, Poke Clary. I'm leaving for delivery. I'll send Yarrow your regards. Poke, I'll return to the fort surely. I'm going to catch up to the root and help him uh, deliver the first core to Ash Twin. Just make sure Yarrow receives it. Of course you are. The white hole cores are for the warp receivers. Each of the six receivers are being constructed at different locations. So those deliveries will be a greater pain in your cervical spine. The tower designs in the high energy lab on Ember Twin reveal each receiver's location. Ask Yarrow, he is familiar with them. Okay. Remove scroll. Ship log updated. Another dead guy here. Pick up scroll. Lo oh, look, look, some cool, like, tools and shit over here. What's this? Of note, Yarrow believes he spotted a flaw in the warp tower designs, namely that one of the warp towers on Ashton will never activate because its warp receiver will never align overhead. Does your romantic interest think of warp tower's alignment point to its receiver? Is its receiver? Does he not know that a warp tower always aligns with the center of its corresponding astral body? That isn't an unreasonable belief given the receiver does have to be located on or in close orbit around the relevant astral body. No, Yarrow understands the distinction. He likely doesn't believe uh he like he doesn't realize the hourglass twins are so close together they function as a single astral body with a shared alignment point in between them i seem to recall that was your understanding of warp technology at first hmm okay 
Sorry. Ooh. Now, what the fuck does that mean? Regarding the warp towers on Ashwin, does each tower have to be perfectly in line with the center of the astral body to which it's tuned? I enjoy precision as much as the next Nomai, but if, for example, a tower's base were to shift even slightly, that tower might not no, might no longer align with its astral body. More accurately, I enjoy precision as much as the next Nomai, provided the next Nomai is not poke. We don't need the alignment angle to be exact. It only needs to be within five degrees of the astral body center. Of note, this gives us a slightly longer warp window. I imagine this window will last roughly several seconds. Okay, so that's like the warp window I'm assuming right there. As such, any Nomai stepping onto the warp platform during the active window will be immediately warped. We will need to be careful. Okay, wait. So where's the platform at? I'm assuming this, when this hits that, we go fucking, we go somewhere. The question is, how do we get to that? Are we already on it? Let's see, I'm gonna go up here real quick. Every time that glows, that, that's got to be like the warp window that we need to hit. Very interesting. Okay, and then this guy's here. Cave Shar. Escape pod. Okay. Hmm. Ash Twin Projection Stone. It's like every, it's like every minute. Or is it going faster? Hmm. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna go bring that over here and see what's going on real quick. I knew I needed it for something. Okay. Here we go. Yo, Burp, thank you very much for the 55 months. Burp Bubbles, appreciate you. What a Miss B, sounds good. Okay, we're gonna put this over here and see what the vibe is. I have good news, Yaro. The advanced warp core is ready to be installed in the central chamber of Ash Twin. I'm intrigued, love. Everyone here working on the Ash Twin project is, is excited to see it. Pi is beside herself with joy. No, it isn't. Is everything well at the forge? The core's durability could still be improved. I need more time. Also, he was rushed. Ignore her, Yaro. The core is finished. And if my sister tells you otherwise, then she will be finished as well. Huh? Don't worry, love. Poke is only nervous. The core is extraordinary, and her design work is beautifully clever. Why did Cl Clary change his tune, like, pretty quickly here? Something, something's a muck. Something is a muck here. What's, what's this? Let's just check out the projection over here, okay? Okay, so now we have... It's this, it's this strange room again where there's a three head staring at you. This is Challenger Tragedy vibes. That is wild. Okay, so now the question is... We, we need to find this window. Yeah, there's something going on. We need to find the window that, uh... The warp works. And we need to get to the spot where it makes sense and see what the vibe is here. There's nothing going on over here. We're not jumping. We're not jumping. We just found a bunch of new things, though, for our flight logs, which is good. This is Outer Wilds. Okay, 
So that is... So you go to the surface. I don't want to do that. This is interesting. I don't know where this goes, though. It seems like it's just like the tower. Like I don't think I'm supposed to go there, really. I'm going to shoot one of these down there. What's up, Sibber? How you doing? Oh, Cyber, sorry. What up, what up? Yeah, it seems like some people, like the scientists and the people who were like the nerds, were rushed. Like, were, like, were the higher ups on their ass to get shit going? Or, like, what the? Or, I don't understand what's going on. Be cautious near the boarding area while the black hole forge is in operation. It's the cautionary tale to every employer trying to hustle their workers. Yeah, the planet definitely doesn't seem like uh, the vibes are good. I'll probably do the DLC after, yeah. Okay, so every time this hits, I wonder if that's when there's an explosion. Let's see. Bro, I wish I could. Ooh, weird. I think, I think we, we, we know all we can here. The next step is either going out onto the uh, surface from over there or exploring more downstairs. Should I just go back to the surface maybe and uh, see what's up? What's up, Toad? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and see see what the vibe is. Oh wait, oh here we go. Yo, Abby, hell yeah! I'm glad you like those. The Hanging City below. Okay, so that's now we're outside. To our friends in Brittle Hall, I just warped here from the White Hole Station. Okay, so that that's we already know about all this stuff. So, ooh, that's a cool picture. Jetpack. That's Feldspar's uh, jetpack. Thank you, man. Yeah, I, I want to I go back to Bramble, I think, with all this new information. Okay, buddy. Thanks for the bits. And Abby, uh, you're in luck. We got a uh, Infinite Craft video going up tomorrow. Phantom Moon, we know about we know about all that as well. We're making we're making some pe pretty big strides. I think the next thing I want to do is try getting to the the Quower, the Quantum Tower. But I might need my ship for it, and I kind of just uh, don't have it right now. Maybe we'll go for either a reset or we'll dip right into the quantum tower somewhere here. <laughs> Might I suggest a place to check out? 
Ooh. Here we go. That was a great grab. Let me talk to Ryback again. Well, I guess that means I've been out for a while, huh? Hanging City's my dream. You, you probably heard the others say it, right? I'm afraid of space. Seriously, I'm more surprised than anyone that I'm out here. Do you want to know how I got this far? I fell. Tripped over a gravity crystal. Oh, yeah. We, we, already, we already met this guy. I learned something. Oh, cool. I found the Nomai. Oh, oh, my God. Look at all these things. Wow. So then the, the Nomai probably came here from somewhere outside the solar system. They must have been in trouble when they launched their escape pod. But what kind of trouble? And where did the escape pod launch from? I'm so curious. This is an amazing discovery. I hope you can find out more about why the Nomai arrived here. I learned something. I saw the old settlement. Isn't it amazing? Hard to believe that the settlement is still standing, but here it is. It really makes you appreciate some living somewhere like Timber Hearth, you know? Somewhere that isn't being constantly bombarded with meteors and rocks and stuff. I learned something. I saw the hanging city on Brittle Hollow. Oh gosh, I was. It was it amazing. Was it beautiful? Was it scary? That's where the Nomai settled permanently on Brittle Hollow. It was their most advanced settlement here. Why they chose to build their most advanced settlement so close to you know what is beyond me. Maybe they th that kind of thing makes sense to a Nomai, though. Maybe they needed the black hole for something. I saw the sun the city on Ember Twin. There's another Nomai city inside the Ember Twin. That's incredible. A whole city. I had no idea it existed. This is great. How did they keep the sand out? If it were me, I'd be nervous about getting buried in the caves by the awful river of sand. The Sunless City. Wow. That means there were two groups of Nomai. One that lived on Ember Twin and one that lived here on Brittle Hollow. But they must have traveled around the solar system since Nomai writing can be found on other planets, too. Where should I go next? Not the Black Hole, actually. That's, that's very no. Which is unfortunate because that's the most exciting stuff uh, below the crust, including the Hanging City. I've already done all that. Cool. See you later. Down, This is my ship. You guys think I can make that? Dude didn't even, dude didn't even, didn't even mention the quow. Oh, there it is. The quantum tower. It's west 190, so it's over here, I think. That thing was moving as I... Okay. We're in a black hole now. All right. I'm going to go to the bathroom, guys. Enjoy looking at the red... Uh, the red sun. Hopefully, it's not too scary. I'll be right back. And then eggs. What planet should I check out next if you, have, if you want to suggest anything?
have to witness some beautiful stuff. Salutes in the chat. Salutes in the chat. We're about to see something nice. Oh my God, look at everything just blowing up on it. Such a good song. Yo, Cam Mapes, thank you very much for the two years, dude. I appreciate that. Do a flip. Here we go. Oops. Whoa, like the lights of all, going off of all the other planets. So interesting. Okay, so it looks like the entire um, universe uh, gets sucked in, into itself and everything uh, stops existing. Hmm. It does kind of sound like uh, M83. Okay, I'm gonna sit down. That was cool. That was cool, but if you rush your employees, the universe implodes, got it. That was cool, but also like really sad. Toad, it's, the, it's like the main theme from this game, I think. If you use your scout to detect it, you won't, you dumb idiot. Do you think I made that just so you could take pretty little pictures of trees? It has multiple uses. Okay. Hey, man, it's me. Eggs, where should I go? Look at this message. I'm looking, I'm looking. Hurry before I, I stop looking at it. I don't know what that means. Ooh. Everything's connected. Everything's connected. All the planet names are blocked. Oh, they had to because of spoilers. Because people suck. Simply misspell it. Yo, is that the Quoom? Hey, Quoom. Hey, Quoom. Did that work? No. Just, yo, just text me. Just text me where to go. Ember Tween. Ember Twins? Was that your way of saying Ember Twins? Okay. That's cool. I was actually thinking about going there anyway. Because I, I still have stuff to do in the uh, the Sun City. Okay. The Fire Fraternals. my suit. Okay. That sun is spicy up there. Ow. All right, Danny, sounds good. Thanks for hanging.
Yo, Caitlin, thank you for the 22 months, by the way. Oh, this place is covered in spikes. The big rock pile. This? Oh, what is this? <laughs> now that's nice. Oh, this is the uh, back entrance. Okay, I remember that. I, I was here before. A little shortcut kind of vibe. Yeah, instead of having to do the, all that other shit, that's actually super big. That's huge. Because we were fo we were focused on um, having to do the other shit a bunch. Okay, here we go. Thank you. That was that was a big. That was big. That was big. Okay, so we got stepping stone district. We have high energy lab trailhead, and we have the eye shrine district. Let's try this one. I don't know if I've done this yet. It's starting to fucking fill up. High energy lab. I didn't get to it last time because there was sand covering it. Okay. Okay, we probably just follow this this cable and then we're chilling. Oh fuck. Oh dick! Hold on. Bro, eat me. Ah! I, I think I have to just wait for it and then just jump over it. Here we go. That's annoying. I'm like one shot now. One shot and fuel us. But now fucking what? Oh. oh god. Oh 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 god oh god oh god. Help. Help. <laughs> Ooh, yes. Yes. go okay I don't I don't go there I think I just go this way what is this place Curious what oh, that's where I just came from. Okay. okay. Oh my god. Okay. Lore incoming, most likely. We're in a lore zone here. What is this? So that's how I open the door. 
Whoa. Oh, yeah. Records show Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the Whitehall Station. Rami and I are devising an experiment to see if this is a real phenomenon or a simple machine error. In theory, what we want to try to reproduce is a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting the white hole at its destination. Initial things first, our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole core with a small white hole core to make the setup on the white hole station. Hypothesis, it, it is possible for an object to exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole. Now that's interesting. Huh. What does it mean, Dave? What is all this shit? Oh, these, oh, these are all the different black holes. These are all the warp cores. Huh. Oh, shit. Let me, let me open this first. What the fuck? Okay, wait. This is getting interesting here. Pick up scroll. That's the one we just used. Or no, that is, I, don't know, not the, I don't think that's the one that we just used. Let's see. And update our experiment. Here, re reproduce the anomaly in arrival and departure times. But Pi is unconvinced it's more than an equipment error. I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eyes. To that end, we decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City's energy supply should prove sufficient. <laughs> of note, Rami, Yaro, re uh, requests that we let him know before we, re we reroute energy to the experiment. I'd hate to leave, leave him in the dark. All available energy has been rerouted from the city to our experiment. Rami and I are about to run a new test. Hypothesis confirmed. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it, Pi saw it. Hypothesis confirmed. This is beyond extraordinary. This changes everything. What a beautiful day for the intersection of abstract theory and practical application. Okay, so they did something with the uh, with the black and white holes that succeeded in their eyes, which is very exciting. Oh shit, there's so much more stuff here. Huh. Oh God. The Southern Observatory is asking if, crea if creating a 22-minute interval, interval is possible. <laughs> that is, to have a, something arrive 22 minutes before it is actually sent through warp. Oh my god, we're doing time travel. We've learned the negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval, the interval increases at an exponential rate. Creating a 22-minute long interval is possible we are currently unable to generate the necessary energy. <clears throat> Remy and I believe it would be necessary to invent a new method of producing energy. A thrilling but enormous undertaking. We would also require advanced warp technology able to handle such energy. We would also likely need an enormous space to fit these proposed new energy and warp technologies together. The only location large enough would be at Ash Twin. The energy is currently unavailable, you say. You're a gas pie. My pun was unintended, Rami, so I believe it's you who's aeriform. Okay, so we're getting a lot of new stuff. Ash Twin is where they're storing the energy, it seems. This thing is fucking crazy. <laughs> the Ash Twin project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically. To build it, we would need a way to travel between Ash Twin and each location that holds crucial project materials. What if we used warp towers like the one that we have on the Whitehall station to connect Ash Twin directly to each critical lo location. Of note, each tower on Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. <laughs> my gratitude, my gratitude to, the, to those who noted my imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. I believe this has been sufficiently clarified. Kindly stop reminding me. We can design each tower to visually reflect its warp destinations. All the towers were built by them. The giant steep tower, for instance, could resemble a cyclone. And we can model the timber hearth tower after a geyser mountain. Ah, look at that. Pokeru and I can begin work on this immediately in the Black Hole Forge. This will keep us busy. 
Interesting. I think I already read this one. Let me just double check, though. Yeah, okay, we already read that one. Okay, so now... Okay, so that is the tower. This is... Okay. This door will need to remain closed for some time. Pi and I are running the experiment based on the extraordinary findings from the White Hole Station. Oh, this is a play this is how I tried getting into the high energy lab before, but it wasn't possible. But now it's open. Okay. Whoa. What up, Mick? Okay, so now. Oh, what the fuck is this? bet if I put two of these here and then I open this up we'll see something crazy oh there they are there are the black oh wait a sec so you shoot, shoot it through the black hole and it comes out the white hole before it, it even goes in. Uh, look at watch, ready? That's what they were talking about. That's what they were talking about. So that is very interesting. But now my question is, what if we do some interesting combos here? Or like two white, two white holes or something. Sorry, I know, I know saying that's annoying, but what are you gonna do? So now this is... Oh my god, look at that. Is it the same vibe? Hmm. Two black holes, what happens there? Nothing. Ooh, interesting. White hole on the left, white hole on the right. Nothing. Okay, so it has to be black and white, okay. Oh, and you get further away, it gets all goofy. Hmm, that is so interesting. This one has nothing. So what do the ones that have nothing mean? I wonder, let's see. Hmm. Ooh, so those are, those are complete opposites. Ooh, so are these. shoot further away hmm.
unable to retrieve scout too many targets. So there, at, at some point, two exist, which is crazy. So you can't pull it back. That's crazy, actually. See, too many targets. Huh. So what does it mean? What does it mean? What does it mean? Uh... Hmm. Let's... See what's up over here. Can I, I wonder if I could put a warp thing into this now and see what that vibe is all about. Let's try this one. Warp core does not fit. Gotta be a place to put this thing. Okay. So those are all the different towers that exist on the different planets. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't think anything happens if I do that. Oh, wow. So, look at that. So, yeah, so the energy now, when it's not energized, it's, it's, it, it works as if it was normal, see? There's no, uh, like, getting there sooner vibes. Oh, shit. We're about to drown. So, this tower is making stuff quicker somehow in some way so they're i wonder I, so i wonder if they did something like on a massive scale so are, so the black hole and the white hole are doing something the ones that we that we've already encountered oh fuck oh shit Uh-oh. Uh that is, uh, <laughs> not looking good. Toad, see you later, dude. Thanks for hanging. Fuel level critical. Nah, we're good. Yeah, that's... That's kind of my nightmare. If I was ever in a situation in real life where, like, the planet was that big in front of me, I'd be like, I'm good. I am good. Okay, here we go. So we're about to experience everything again. I feel like the sun seems chill. Like I want to go inside of it. Womb is somewhere. Is that it? No, that's God, bro. Huh, so I wonder if I shoot my uh, scout through the black hole that we currently know about, if something 
we'll see something happen that hasn't happened already, or vice versa, or we'll start something that hasn't happened yet, that will happen. These kind of games, bro, it reminds me of like movies that are like time travel-y and it just like hurts my brain sometimes. Do you feel me? It's exciting though, it's fun, but also it's kind of like, huh? Okay, so now I'm just waiting to see what happens here. Inception hurt my brain for a little bit and then I, then I like loved it. Okay, so everything's gonna line up at some point. I'm assuming. This is gonna be our first time experiencing the end of the universe at this little spot where everything, everything lines up. Maybe. Which, if that's the case, that's also interesting. Yeah, remember when I first saw Interstellar? I thought it was like, I actually thought it was kind of bad. I was like, this movie's cringe. They went like the, the time travel route and I thought it was like stupid. But then I watched it like as I was more mature and I was like, oh, this is the best movie I've ever seen in my life. Because the whole concept is fucking awesome, how they did it. Mayor, it's the same director too, so that's probably why. You probably got, you know, confused a little bit. Let's get some banjos in the chat, guys. Quantum Moon. What if I don't look at it? What if I look away from the explosion? If I don't if I don't look at the explosion, I wonder if anything happens. What's up, Slangly? It's a quantum expo explosion, yeah, exactly. Rookie, that probably that's probably true. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, that's interesting. Oh, no. Now that's a desktop wallpaper. Now that's the new thumbnail. No, come on, I'm kidding. Yo, Fawnick, thanks for the two years, by the way. Maps, thank you for the two years. Awesome. We had a lot of two year resubs today. Siri, play Red Wine Supernova. Bye. Chapel Rowan. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna, I need to go check out my journal. I feel like we learned a lot of new things just now. We, we learned a lot about each other also, guys. Let's see here. High Energy Lab, Ash Twin Tower Designs. Okay, so now we know about this. The Nomai successfully reproduced the temporal anomaly first observed at the Whitehall Station. Warped objects appear before appear to arrive before they depart. That's crazy. Yo, eggs, that was cool. The Nomai discovered they could increase the negative time interval between arrival and departure by adding energy to the warp cores. The Nomai wanted to know if a 22-minute negative time interval was possible. They concluded it would require new technology to produce the necessary energy. So there, I'm assuming there's something that happens where we have like 22 minutes to potentially save the universe from destruction or it's already too late um, or there's probably a cannon or tower somewhere that is not broken because it was sent through prematurely and we have the fixed one somewhere else There's, uh, there's something. There's something happening. I, I, I don't know. There's something happening. I need, to, I need to talk to someone. I need to go to, like, to the quantum fucking tower or something. What's this? 
Every memory recorded by a Nomai statue is transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within Ash Twin. Yeah. Are we the saviors? Are we the, the, are we the destroyers? Are we also Nomai? And we don't realize it? So much to think about. I still feel like I, I have to go to... Um, Okay, wait a minute. Dark Bramble. Do we know enough about Dark Bramble to go there? Now. Now that we know about like the the black and white holes. Cause this place is cool, but it's a little annoying. But it's bigger on the inside. These giant fishes are here. Just gotta figure out how to maneuver correctly. Ow. Take the ship to repair. Up. Quantum moon, angler fish fossil, escape pod, <laughs> old settlement, the vessel. We seem to find the vessel. Sunless city. There's still more to explore in the sunless city. Fucking a. We got to go back there at some point too. Then. Um. Gravity Cannon. Hanging City. We don't really have much about Bramble here, huh? Let's go. Dark Bramble. One of the three Nomai escape pods never made it out of Dark Bramble. Uh, the Nomai warped to the solar system in a spaceship called the Vessel. Oh, so the Vessel's here. The vessel is here, which is crazy. Okay, so maybe we we do a little one of these. Stress beacons. Thoughts? Okay, so right there is something. But the question is, how do we not get eaten by a fucking fish? You know? Ow, 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 ow. Oh, is the red light the vessel? No shot, buddy. Oh my god, there's ships in one of these fucking anglerfish! Maybe. goes away. We were right there. Hold on. Okay. 
interesting. Okay, so it's one of those things. What the fuck is that? is this? level critical shit. Okay. Wait. So when I used when I used my thing, it like That was freaky. Okay. Now we know uh what to do. That was cool. I can't tell if we were close or if like we were closer when we I don't know, it's there's something there's something going on though. There's something going on for sure. We're gonna go again. Dark Bram. Yeah, that felt good. Um, it's definitely Lost Woods vibes from Zelda. 100%, where it's like, you have to go, you have to go to the, the correct way almost in order for you to continue your progress. Which is cool. Oh shit. Almost died. Jacob, uh, that's what it seems like, but I think there's a, there's a whole ass story to it as well. Like we're, we're learning a lot about a whole civilization and a bunch of other stuff. What's up, Burb? How you doing, dude? Learning is the story. There you go. Doctor Who vibes? Yeah, that's fair. Cool. Shit. Suit up. Let's go. Let's do this. Okay, so the first one is this light. So it seems like the lights are either. A little universe area that you want to go to, or it's a anglerfish, which you don't want to go to. So it's that's your op. Those are your options. Very different options, hundred percent. Okay. 
So the next one is down here. fuck is that? Whoa. The final ship. The final escape pod. Our escape pod crashed. We tried to flee. Hold on. Oh, shit. No, no, no. We pulled out as long as we could here, but this pod supply of breathable air is nearly depleted, and the anglerfish attack more and more frequently. Our best chance of survival is to return to the vessel to either repair the damage or more probably await rescue. Seca, is the message finished? The vessel's beacon is already growing fainter. It will be gone in a matter of hours. We need to leave here quickly. Okay. Um. Ooh. We need, I need to read all this shit real quick too. Escape pod three vessel has been mortally mortally injured. Now escaping. Multiple collisions have altered pod's trajectory. Navigation error. Life support error. Propulsion error. Scan complete. Grab not detected. Breathable air not detected. Multiple life forms detected. Do not exit pod. Verdict. Oops. There's a new problem. Our equipment is detecting two distinct beacons from the vessel. But it is impossible for the vessel to be in two different locations at the same time. I agree, but the beacons are exactly identical to each other. Perhaps if I had more time. Uh-oh. We're nearly out of time, Din. But it is impossible, okay? But, but, um, we will follow the beacon whose source is nearest to us. But suppose that beacon is false. We luckily don't have enough air to reach the far farther of the two beacons, Din. The decision is made for us. We'll leave a trail of lights as we go. There's still a chance someone could hear our escape pod's distress signal. Whoa. Emergency escape hatch. Oh, and there's all the lights. Are those the lights that I want to go to? Maybe? I think I follow these lights. Here we go. Whoa! Oh my god, there's, there they are. Oh, there's a bunch of them! Oh, they're fucking floating around dead. No, dude. And I'm gonna join them. Is this the vessel? Anyone who came here searching for us, uh, we followed one of the two beacons from the vessel to this place, but now we can go no further. It's almost too faint to hear now, but the vessel's beacon is still faintly emitting from within this thorny seed. Yet the opening is too small for even a single no mine to fit through, so our escape pod couldn't have thrown through here. I don't understand how this could be possible, but this gruesome place seems able to manipulate space itself. Maybe this was our undoing. To be close to the location of the vessel and still so far away is difficult. Worse, the vessel's beacon is dying. Soon, we'll be not able to hear it. There's nothing we could do now but try to perhaps find a way inside or at least attempt to comprehend why this happened. My dearest hope is that we reach other, is that the other escape pods were able to reach sa relative safety, safety. Oh my God.
Duplicate signal, huh? Error. So it's... Is this the one that's on Tim Timbuktu? That we, that, like the seed on Timbuktu that we're on? Timber art? Nah, the vessel can't be on where we uh, can't be on our house. No shot, bud. No shot, the answer was there all along, guys. Come on. Oh, we just learned a lot of stuff. Man, it's so sad everyone's dying. Oh my god, these guys are hugging! It's a three way hug over here! Oh, that's so sad, bro. Dang. And I died next to him. What's up, Benbo? How you doing? Holy crap. Okay, wait. But now we know something. Now we know... That the seed on, on our planet might... Maybe it's like a black hole, white hole situation. And the vessel is somewhere else. Because there, the fact that they said there was two vessels means that there is another one somewhere. Which is promising, perhaps, for this uh, civilization here. So escape pod three. Know my grave. Uh, the survivors, uh, the Nomai could faintly hear the vessel's beacon from within the seed, but the opening was too small for a single Nomai to fit through, much less than it. The vessel's beacon was dying. If I launch my scout inside the seed, I can take photos of an enormous, derelict Nomai ship. Okay. Interesting. So now... I think we go to the, uh... I took photos of the, of the vessel, apparently, is what it's saying. Dang, everything reminds me of her. Okay, we're gonna go over here. This is the other tower that we know about. That's where the ghost particles are. <laughs> Eggs, you are you made the same joke? That is... Yeah, where's that C? That's where I'm trying to go. It's around here somewhere. It's around here somewhere, I think. There's that weird cabin. Oh. Okay, well, <laughs> looks like we're going on foot, guys. Perfect. Yo, Sage with the 23 months, let's go. Ow. up Tino yeah guys just refresh if you uh, lost connection yeah I don't know why that happened <laughs> yeah Mary that was that was good 
Okay, hold on. Let's see. That is right there. That's where we're, that's where we're going. That's it. So wait. If we could somehow get in here, this perhaps contains the vessel, which is a big deal. Now, am I small enough to, to climb through this? Or is this person? Let's talk and ask. They're taking that tin can of yours into space today. What are you still doing here? <clears throat> is that a dark bramble seed? Yeah, it is. We already know about this. We talked about this, you and me. Okay. Duplicate symbol error or signal. Okay. Hmm. Is there a distress signal here? Okay, that's interesting. Escape pod two. That's ice, it looks like. Harmonica. What's up, Zoe? How are you? Huh? Okay. Ooh, I wonder if we see where this scout goes. Air, duplicate single. Wait, should I go check out where the duplicate signal is? Or am I a little bitch? Because that's the second one that showed up. 13 kilometers away. Yeah, we'll, we'll maybe check that one out. Give me a fucking sec. So what does that mean? Okay, so we're going back to... Uh, this fucking asshole place, but that's okay. But now we know our. Now we fo now we follow the scout. It's Lost Woods Part Two now. Okay. What am I? What am I touching? Yo, Kibby not thanks for the six months. Appreciate that, dude. Welcome back. Something, something's happening here. We're cooking with portals now, guys. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Whoa. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. It's fine. It's fine. That was meant to happen. Okay. Okay. Okay, all you gotta do is just go down. Scout's over here now. Okay. Okay. This might be the, the real deal here. We are going to run out of all of our fuel before this works out for us, but you know what? God damn it, we tried our best.
made you crash your plane in, in flight sim. Sorry. Oh god, there's so many lights. Huh? Whoa! What does that mean? Bro, wait. Okay, so this is a paradox we're dealing with, guys. We're dealing with the time paradox. Because what happened was, one went through the fucking hole, and then two came out. And then that happened again, and again, and again. So now we're going to have a million fucking things going on here. Oh, great. It's got to be the one that's closest, though, right? Or am I, am I a weird dude? I'm going to go for the one that's closest. Ah, oh, shit. This is crazy. You better not. You better not. You better not tell me there's a million over here. dead one. Oh, it's fucking it's, it's, it's Feldsbar. Is this Feldsbar? It's Feldsbar! Where'd you come from? No one's here? No one's come here in well ever, actually. That makes you the second Harthian to ever reach Dark Bramble after me, of course. Well done. Say it's you. you they made you an astronaut. You haven't blown yourself up yet. Good for you. Feldbar, you're alive? You never were the brightest hatchling, were you? Yeah, that's right, I'm alive. I've been camping out here since my ship uh, crashed violently. You crashed? We're the greatest pilot in Harthian history. I haven't lived in polite society for a while, so I'm just going to go ahead and assume that wasn't sarcasm. My story goes like this. I just finished exploring the core of Giant's Deep, and I wanted to try my hand at Dark Bramble, seeing as no one has ever been before. Getting around in Dark Bramble was easy, mind you. Once you've dodged one massive interdimensional vine bristling with thorns, you've dodged them all. But after a while, I run into the huge anglerfish. You've seen them. Big gnarly things, and this was the biggest one I've ever seen. I pull a few stuns, try to shake the thing off. Nothing too fancy. I'm going full speed when the fish clips me, knocks me into a vine, and, well, like I said, I crash. Blammo. On impact, my ship starts making noise like it's coming apart from the inside. And I think, well, this, that, that ain't great. Sure enough, I barely get out of there before the electrical systems start sparking like crazy. It's either move fast or die unpleasantly, so I had to put a little distance between me and my friend, my, my poor fried ship. I camped out near where I crashed at first. I found the skeleton later. Great find, would have been stupid not to use it. So I set, moved my setup over here, and planted my emergency tree seeds, and I've been here ever since. No wonder there are so many stories about you back up. Wow, yeah, pretty much. Anyway, that's how it all went down, Hatchling. Story's over, feel, feel free to stay and enjoy the fire a while. Or don't, fire's not going anywhere. Oh my god. I found something. I found a dark bramble seed on Timber Hearth. That's bad business, Hatchling. As Tur will tell you, if you so much as glance in Dark Bramble's direction, there used to be a fifth planet where the bramble is now. This infernal plant, bro, is the sixth planet that is rumored to uh, have the quomb consumed within Dark Bram? Think about it, chat. Is the quomb in Dark Bramble sometimes? If we don't get the seed that you found sort of real quick like I suspect Timberhearth will be heading toward the same fate and I tell you what we Harthians have overcome far too much to be done in by some worthless seed okay I found something I found no my writing saying anglerfish are blind the blast things do have a weakness <laughs> meaning my fly as fast as I can approach to dealing with them could have used a bit more thought behind it oh well at least they didn't eat me all's well that ends well Aunt Hatchling uh, where should I explore next? That's the spirit. Ever tried throwing your scout into one of those weird seeds? See where the little opening is just big enough to launch one through. But inside, yeah, we know this. We know this. It's Feldsbar. Let's see. Um, you reached the core of Giant's Deep. How'd you do it? But since you're asking, God, assume you haven't made it down to yourself yet. If I, if I tell you how, it kind of feels like cheating. On a completely unrelated note, there was a big hollow vine my ship crashed into. Yep. If you were... If I were you, I'd go take a walk and see where it ends. You'll want you'll want to get to the tail end of this anglerfish skeleton here and look for a flickering light in the fog. That'll be my old ship. Path starts there. 
Okay, let me get some more fuel. Cool. Anything else? Shouldn't I tell ground control to come get you? Well, yeah, sure, whenever you have the time. Frankly, I kind of like it out here. Quiet, peacefulish. You're a little young to understand, but it's a lot of pressure being the best that ever was. Been nice to have a break. Okay, so there's my duplicate error. Oh, shit. That's not where I want to go. Yeah, that was Ash Ketchum vibes, the way he said that. Where's your ship? Not far from here, as a matter of fact. If you go straight past the tail of this anglerfish skeleton, you'll see a flickering light in the fog. Okay. The tail of this anglerfish. So this is the mouth, I'm assuming. Oh, there's the, there's the flickering light right over there. Uh, there she goes. Ah! Dick. I'm gonna die down here. Repair this or no? It's seeming like probably no, right? this mean? There's the seed. Oh, is, is there another feldspar over here? No fucking way, baby. Or am I a piece of shit? Wait, huh? Oh yeah, right there. Or was I already here? Am I a weird guy? Uh, uh -huh. Interesting. Here we go this way. So I'll know if that's the real one or not. Oh, uh, now, now there's all these fucking duplicates coming in. So interesting. Duplicate signal. So that's that's different from the one that I sent out, I think. That's crazy. There's a bunch of them.
guy wants me to roast a marshmallow with him. I got you, brother. What? Bro, that thing just landed. Do you see that? Huh? Was that because I roasted a marshmallow? No. That was a long time ago, I feel like. Oh, so the other one's all the way up there. And it it's slowly coming down. That's so interesting. Try throwing your scout into one of those weird seeds. See there with the little opening? It's just big enough to launch one through. Your scout will teach you the, will tell you the scout is in two places at once, but I don't think that's wrong exactly because space doesn't work right in here. That seed looks small. See, but inside it's bigger, much bigger. I've had a lot of time to think about this. My theory is space in dark bramble kind of expands as you go through each sphere. That's why it's bigger inside those seeds. It seeds. That's my theory. Keep in mind that while you're exploring dark bramble and maybe you won't get lost inside forever. Good luck. Okay, so he, he wanted me to do that. Oh, in regards to the giant seat, he told me that there was a secret that he didn't want to tell me. Um, you made it down there. If I tell you right now, it kind of feels like cheating. On a completely unrelated note, that sure was a big hollow vine my ship crashed into. Yep. If I were if I were you, I'd go take a walk and see where it ends. Oh, so I have to go onto the uh, the vine. Not the actual ship. Duh. So I need to go inside this. Fuck. Yo, Raven, nice. This is the right way. We'll find out. Now. Whoa. What the fuck is this? Huh? the interloper what the fuck is that that's a big old jellyfish that's dead <laughs> never thought i'd see one of these beasts outside giant seat they were awful useful back there maybe a jellyfish could be useful here too blair this thing tastes terrible the, in the outside is all rubbery and tough maybe that's because it insulates the jellyfish's insides from getting zapped by electricity right i'm going inside of this jellyfish interior cavity to see if there if it's what if what's in there tastes any better. Huh? Now where the hell is this? Hmm. Okay. That jellyfish shit's on dark, dark, on bramble? Huh. Or is it? Wait, that's bramble. What the fuck is this place? Huh. Ow. 
That's okay. We run it back. It was almost time anyway. Wait, we just learned a lot of shit. I've also never played Exit 8 now. We just learned so much new stuff. So... Where the fuck was I? Yeah, that's a good question. I think I was in a different fucking planet that doesn't exist. Or a different universe, even. <sighs> hmm. Something's amok here. We gotta get to the bottom of this. Let's see. Feldbar camp. Frozen jellyfish. Okay, so what is this? There's more to explore here. So if I mark it on my map, I wonder where it brings me. Frozen jellyfish is 28 kilometers away. Oh, so it, no, it is on Bramble, okay. Unless it's like inside Bramble. Is there a whole ass universe inside this fucking place? Because if that's the case, shut up. Is it its own like black hole? You couldn't finish this game because Bramble scared you so much? It's definitely a little weird. Oh, so the jellyfish is right here. What up, Nipfy? How you doing? Turn suit. Okay. Ooh, so we can go down here. Okay. Shit. Ow. Jellyfish. Nip, nip, it's fun. It's very fun. Yeah, it does look like tree roots, yeah. terrifying to watch nah we're good we, we got this um okay Yo, Steve, thanks for the 15 months. Welcome back. Bro, it, it better not make me have to go all the way back in there and do all that again. Come on.
Yeah, this is Bram, yeah. Yeah, it is ice. Yeah, I think we're just cooked. Like, I think the only way to get to that area is, is through that vine. Yeah, I think I was inside the ice before, but... Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. I think this is it. Oh, no, it's like frozen right here. Oh, maybe I can go th underneath it, my um, ship. Maybe I can go like underneath and then take my ship up. I'll try that. A lot of progress though today. Mr. Me and uh, Stevie, thank you guys, by the way. <clears throat> I'm trying to learn more about this uh, this frozen jellyfish uh, from the people who were here before. It might hold the uh, the answers and the secrets to the world, to the universe. So that's what we're going to uh, go do. Fourteen kilometers. Sheesh. Oh, God. Oh, God. The thing about the immortal jellyfish is we don't know technically if it's immortal or not because it just hasn't died yet, but it could, right? Like eventually it could, you know? I don't wanna, why is it focusing on the sun? Immortal until I get my hands on it. What the shit? Becca said, fu fu fuck that jellyfish. Oh, it regenerates? Oh, maybe. There we go. I too am a frozen jellyfish. All right, we're gonna get in. Uh, we're gonna get in here, and that's the vibe. Yeah, the, the controller bug is really annoying, but.
Fuck. The fish? No, it's a char shard of ice. I thought that was fish. What's up, Yusuf? How you doing, dude? It's up. Fuck me. God fucking damn it. Alright. Oh, there's my ship. Let me get back into that fucking thing. Thanks. Cool. and jellyfish, huh? Oh, the iOS update's bad? Yeah. Tw Twitch sucks on the phone. I don't know what the fuck they're, they're thinking. Maybe there's something here that I need to check out. Yes, bro. Come on. That's what we were trying to do this whole fucking time. Okay. Play recording. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Do not eat this even if you are dying. It would be too sad if this was the last thing you ever ate in your life. I guess these jellyfish are only useful for insulation from electricity. Again, do not eat. Love Feldspar. Oh, I wonder if the jellyfish is how he got to the core. On Giants Deep. Because there's, there's a jellyfish on the planet, I'm pretty sure. And if it's good against electricity, that might be a play. And I think that's all we really needed to learn from that, was that little piece of information. I'm going to get out of here.
Yo, what up, Keanu? How you doing, dude? Strawberry, I didn't. I, I I assumed you were supposed to be able to, but yeah, nah, I felt good. We're speed running. We're speed running, even though we have like 15 hours in this game, probably. I think now we go to uh, Giant, whatever the fuck it's called, the Giant, Giant's Deep, and we have to find the jellyfish on that planet. Let's see if that means anything. Yusuf, I'm assuming yes. I'm assuming yes. Just giant steep. That's it. Nothing, nothing more, nothing less. There's the quoom right there as well. I'm gonna go talk to uh, our boy. What's his name? Who's here? Garbo. Or Grundle, whatever. I'm gonna talk to him and uh, see what he knows about the jellyfish. Two times ass, gravity habit ass, fucking planet. I need to figure out how to also not die to that, also. A few loops ago, a cyclone came by and tossed my little island into space. Dying like that was kind of unpleasant. I found something. Hmm. I saw your ship again. I hope it's having fun. Do you say hi for me? Stay calm. Deep breaths. No, seriously, I meditate. No, I'm good. Where should I explore in Giant's Deep? I keep... Yeah, okay. We already did that one. Okay, so there's that. So now we know that there's a potential octopus, or, or je not octopus, jellyfish, that we could use to maybe get to the core. That's, I think that's what the guy was pretty much saying. Or like, if it's covered in electricity or whatever the fuck, it can go through the core. So we need to figure out how to do that in some capacity. Oh, there it is. There it is. Just chilling right there.
Or is the jellyfish the one in charge? I'm curious. Fucking dolphin ass, yeah, right? Come on. Is he the one? He's, yeah, the jellyfish is the one controlling everything. Where the fuck am I? I'm getting tossed around. What's up, Nick? How you doing, dude? Oh, there's multiple jellyfish on this thing. I'm gonna get out of this fucking. Jellyfish eventually flops into the air. Isn't there, there? I think there's one somewhere that's dead, or like in a cavern. That wasn't the one that we saw the other day. Maybe it's over here. Go. Go, under, go under there. Okay. You like hmm. it's because the gravity is so bad on this planet, you can't really do anything. Let me get this water real quick here and spin around. Shit. Yo, lost my universe. Thanks for the six months in advance. What the hell? Thank you, dude. Ow. There's my scout. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Welcome on in, man. That's awesome. I could have sworn there was a jellyfish, like, on this planet somewhere, like a dead one. Or I could maybe commandeer its body and, like, use it to go somewhere. Just fucking drowning right now. Instead. Just take me out of here. Okay. Then 
That's the, uh... There's an island right there. I'm just gonna go on that island. Oh, never mind. It's just going up instead. Can I get on there too, or fuck you? Great. Yo! Ever with the 56 bones, dude. What is up? How the hell are you doing? Hello, hello, dude. Three minutes of oxygen remaining. Great. Just pick me up, please. Ooh, a nice little new desk. Okay. What's up, licorice? I just keep getting tossed out. <laughs> I keep getting tossed out. I have no fuel, no health, no friends. Yeah, this planet's trash. Uh, Nick, I'm down. Big country. I've never played No Man's Sky, so I have no idea. I love ping pong, right? Same. Here we go. Please just send me up here. Both exploration games, but that's where the similarities end, yeah. Just kill me. Hit me with a fucking tree or something at this point. <clears throat> 60 seconds, great. see here. Fuel level critical. This place. This place stinks. Okay. We're going to try again. There's definitely a, a planet or like an island on this planet that has a fucking jellyfish body somewhere. I'm pretty sure. I forget where though. So I, remember, I, I think it was like my first playthrough. I remember seeing like a jellyfish. So now we know that if you use its body, you could enter the core. Because I would break through the current or something. There's something there. Oh wait, no, there's also a um there's no there you know what it is? There's a fucking jellyfish on the interloper. There's a j frozen jellyfish on the interloper, I think. That's what I was thinking of. Or the Atler Rock. Let me see. It's one of these things has a jellyfish on it. Is it this? No, I think it's on the interloper. us at all. In case an ice.
eggs. Is, am, am, I, am I close? Is Oh, and there's the white hole over here. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely just saying stuff. The sixth location. Can I show rumor mode? Sure. There's rumor mode. What's up, Fleb? How you doing, dude? It's on Giants. Okay, it is on Giants Deep, and it's on Island. Okay, cool. So I, I, I might I might have a Giants Deep. Construction yard, indefinite hiatus, quantum signal, silent uh, statue workshop. Okay. Yeah, it's on one of these islands. It's not Gabros. It might be on the construction yard or it might be on Statue Island. Uh, it might be, maybe it's construction yard. We'll go over here. Maybe we'll check out the quantum reading or see if there's an escape pod or some shit. What's up, Ambi? How you doing? Here we go. <clears throat> they let anyone in? Club, is that your girlfriend, your best mate, or your other account? Be honest. That's your best friend, let's go. It's me, Flabev. And they were roommates. Okay, I think, I have a feeling that there's something here. Fleb maids, uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Lori. Okay. Eggs, do what you gotta do, dude. I'm not gonna play too much longer. Uh, once I figure out this jellyfish shit, I'll probably call it there because I don't want to, you know, play too long. Because we already almost have six hours. Plus, I know you you like to watch. Um, there's definitely something around here. Okay. See you in the VOD. See you later, eggs. Thanks for helping today, dude, and hanging. Appreciate you, pal. And let's game soon for sure. Just hit me up whenever. Hmm. Yeah, text me tomorrow, yep. Sounds gooch. Drink vodka. Yeah, I know. This, uh... So anyways, now that she's gone, we can talk bad shit. Smiles, yeah, you said that you were, um... What were you... You said you were drinking, like, a certain drink. Screwdrivers, right? You said you were drinking screwdrivers earlier. Got a pick of licorice watching stream posting in pets. Yo! Let me check that out. Uh, we discovered that the um, jellyfish are able to penetrate the core, which is a good thing. Okay. 
Let me see um, this picture real quick of Lippers here. Oh God. Oh, that's cute. That is cute. Oh God, oh God, oh God. Okay, we're floating in the air. Ow, not good. Also kind of sick though that we're floating. And back in the water. Ah, fuck. Oops. Okay. So that, you don't want that to happen guys. You don't want that to happen when you uh, when you do it. <gasps> Oops. Yeah, this planet hates me. This game rewards persistence. I could tell. Giants deep. Okay. It's not got, it's, I don't think it's here. Maybe it's the statue island? I, I don't know. Maybe there's another island that we don't have on here yet. Your logs tell you, is it quantum signal? Probably. Okay. She is the queen. The queen can do no wrong. It simply is true. Okay, giants deep. That's our curl womb. Can I get the fuck in here? Is this the tower? Is this the other tower that I haven't been to yet? What the fuck is that? What is this? This is the other tower that they built. Oh shit. Okay, so this is the one for this planet. 
Whoa, that's cool. Oh, is this how you get down to the fucking depths? Yeah, I haven't been here yet. Pot of coffee is on, brothers. We're back. Wait, what the fuck is this place? This is cool. You're giggling? Bro, I didn't know this was a thing. Ooh, okay, hold on. What, what, okay, what, what? We welcome in this place. The tower shares with all who has the knowledge needed to make his or her first quantum journey. Is this the Quower? Is this the Quantum Tower? And is it connected to the fucking Bramble place? Or, uh, Brittle Hollow? Nah, come on, it's not. There's no way. There's no way this is the Quower. Enter this place without friends. However, these are lessons to learn for yourself. Good thing I have none. Give me some trees. The quantum tower. Something is happening here. What the fuck? Seek the wandering arch. Huh? Oh! Whoa! Cool. So it moves if you're not looking at it. That's sick. Okay, what's the next? Whoa! There's that fucking thing. Okay. Observing a quantum object, observing an image of a quantum object. These are the same. Observing a quantum object. Observing an image of a quantum object. There's, okay, so that's interesting. So an image of that rock is the same as the actual rock? Because quantum mechanics are different? Is that what we're talking about? Now that, oh, that's gone. There's the arch. Can't get up there really though. Cause my... Fuck. Wait. If I take a picture of the arch, does that count? Bitch. For anything? No. Was that. Wait. Was that me? Oh my god, look, that's what I look like. Hey. Sup? <laughs> Selfie time, man. That's cool. Oh, I'm so smart. Check this out, chat. Check this out. Well, I'm not smart, but this, this is cool. So what you're going to do here is you're going to... feel me like you're you know what I mean like I have to like not see it and then it'll pop up is the vibe hold it felt right it felt good it felt good give me a sec okay so there it is right there right and then now it's now it's moved and now there's the tree that's right here okay Okay. Got it. We gotta. We gotta figure this out. Okay. Fuck. Ooh. 
See how it moves? Oh, so when you look up, it goes away. Okay, wait, hold on. Hmm. But it doesn't show up. This is so... Tree moves. Hmm. Like, I wish I, I can't get up there. Sorry, breaking your brain. Yeah, the yeah, the crew. Okay, wait. So these both are right here, which is interesting, which means, okay, and that's fucking gone now. Oh my God. I'm trying to get to the arch, but to get to the arch, you have to, like, not see it first. Oh, I think I know what to do. I need to, sh I need to shoot this through it. Okay. Okay. works it's because i was taking a picture and it kept it quantized bro that fucking worked fuck it fuck you okay sure okay now we're now we're here again oh shit the arch and the crystal do not naturally meet Okay, so this is the crystal. This is interesting. Hmm. Okay, let's think about this. So...
Fuck, I had it! Shit! I had it. God damn it. Hold on. Fuck! Unidentified signal nearby. Ow. This is the last one, but we made it harder. Oh, cool. Uh... Oh, okay, I get it. So it's like, oh. Okay, so there's only two. I get it. That's cool. That's cool. That's fun. Huh. Come on, bitch. No, get closer to me. What the fuck? No! Dang. Okay, hold on. Now this is gaming. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so there we go. Stay. Stay. Ho. Oh. Ah. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Wait. Nay. Oh. Shit.
Oh, maybe you just have to do it like this. I am a god. Oh shit, what the fuck is this place? What is this place? Is this the quantum mania? We offer our congratulations. You've learned the rules of quantum imaging. Take this knowledge with you on the remainder of your quantum pilgrimage. Reminder, uh, remember, the other quantum shards uh, have other lessons to teach. Our curiosity goes with you on your journey. You walk in the footsteps of those who came before you and your path guides you, uh, guides those who will follow later. Okay, that's a lot of information, I think. So what I learn? I learned that I have what it takes. No, I think I have to do some quantum goofery uh, to really get to the bottom of this. You know what I mean? I mean, you jumped in the hole to get to the bottom of this, am I right? True. We know. We now know stuff. I think. Let me real quick go on my ship and see what the vibe is. I'm gonna I'm gonna talk to my ship real quick and see my uh, my log, the tower of quantum. The tower held knowledge a nomai needed to make his or her first quantum journey. Observing a quantum object, observing an image of a quantum object, they're the same. The nomai called this the rule of quantum imaging. Remember, the other quantum shards have lessons to teach. The other shards. Oh, so the other uh, the other quantum objects in the tower have lessons to teach, is what they're saying. Oh wait, let me go, let me go heal real quick first. No, not really, oh. Oh shit, the water's about to kill us. The shards around the universe. Oh, so anytime we, see, we run into shards, there's gonna be it, uh, knowledge to learn. What's up, Creamy? How you doing? Wait, so now we, um... Let's see. So we have a lot of... Yeah, that was a really good loot. We got a lot done. Tower of Quantum Knowledge, the Gravity Cannon, the Tower of Quantum Trials, the Quantum Shard. I still need to do this. It holds useful knowledge for the Nomai embarking on their first pilgrimage to the Quantum Moon. A Nomai named Solanum was about was told to visit the Tower of Quantum Knowledge on Brittle's on Brittle Hollow's equator to learn one final rule before embarking on a pilgrimage to the Quantum Moon. Oh, let me piss real quick, and then I I, I have a theory about the Quantum Moon and all this. Oh, wait, I'm about to die. Okay, well, I'm gonna go piss real quick, and then um we're gonna figure out how to get to the Quantum Moon.
So, what I learned, guys, here's my hypothesis. I have to launch, I have to launch something, right? Onto the quantum moon. I have to launch a, I have to launch my fucking probe or my scout or whatever onto it in some degree. So we have it, we have it, we have its location. You know what I mean? Um, and since it's a quantum object, the image means it's still real which is cool, but also knowing where it is, I don't know exactly what I'm saying, but I think that's definitely uh, something we have to do. We have to shoot, at least try to shoot uh, the moon with something to see what the vibe is. I've done this before though, I've done it before, but I think now that we know we have uh, some sort of way to uh, keep it to at least know where it's at is interesting. So maybe the fuck is it? There it is. Is that it? I think that's it. Okay. Okay, so the quantum moon, when you shoot through it, it disintegrates. Like my, my, my scout just like goes away. But retrieve, but a retrieve scout is still an option, which is strange. Now let's say I, I look away from it real quick. Now it's gone, but where's my scout now on, in, in the scheme of things, right? Like where's my scout at all? Is it anywhere? What the fuck is that? It looks like a Goron. What is that? Is that a ship? Bro, it looks like a fucking Goron just chilling by himself. From far away. Someone clipped that. For real. Dick. a ship we're getting we're getting sidetracked sorry 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 for tree scout okay so that's interesting when scout launcher at? It's not even showing up as like an option anywhere. Which is interesting. Hmm. Quoom. Oh shit. We'll, we'll run that back. That was the that was the sun. The sun is close to the moon, but uh, it's very also very different. Happens to the best of us. It really does, actually. Okay, here we go. We run it back. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on. Quoom. Where are you at? Gorn. There it is. 
There she is. Hold. Bingo. So let's try this again. The headlights off is interesting. Check the log just uh, a second ago. Shit, fuck. Hold on. Oh, I wonder. Oh, bro. What if you look at it? What if we keep our eyes on it for a fuck ton of time and it gets caught in some other bullshit or we get it to go through the fucking uh, white hole or black hole? Like we just keep our eyes on it a bunch. So it has no choice but to like go through weird shit. Like, if, while, while we're just floating with it, like, it just hits a fucking, like, black hole or something. And then it gets, then it becomes, like, multiple versions. This makes sense. This actually makes sense, Eggs. You're, you're acting like it doesn't make sense, but it's actually smart. Like, if I don't take my eyes off of it, and it's just in front of me this whole time, and it eventually fucking flops into, like, a black hole. That's sick. Because then you might get two moves. Okay. But it's orbiting this planet right now. It was music. Wait, why is this music so good? Is this the Queen music? Okay. Okay, so wherever you look at the Queen. It looks like a planet sticks around it as well. So right now we have Giants Deep. Huh. Now it's going down there. know about we know about the black hole and the white hole and how there's a 22 second or there's like a little bit of a delay so if i go through is it the white hole or the black hole that i want to go through that uh like i go through it before it actually happens vibes there's something there as well Also, look at this. There's nothing there now, or is there? We have an invisible moon locked on. Oh, there it is. Oh, what the fuck? It's still there, never mind. Okay, now I looked away, now it's gone. Cool. Okay, that's cool. So, let's see. 
let's see. Which, which planet has a black hole? have fathers? It's a good question. The, the brittle ones have uh, black holes in there. Okay, so th there it is again. No, Coombe is very different. It's a very different thing. Bubonic space, what well, oh, no, up? Thanks for the resub. How would you leave the ship if you can't look away? Uh, I don't know. I think I think as long as we're kind of there, it's it's, a, it's okay. Giant's deep. Guys, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> what was that? Where's my ship? That's all I have left of my ship is this little fucking tip? Oh, great. Great. Just my ship tip and that's it? Oh, we're screwed. We are fucking screwed. No, I didn't use eject. I mean, my ship just broke off. Holy shit. We're screwed, guys. Ow. Okay. Where's the Quum at? Fastest man I should have played with that Okay, man. Okay. Yo, what up, Andy? Yo, thanks for the raid, dude. What up, guys? Welcome on in. We are uh, playing some Outer Wilds right now. Okay, and I'm dead. We're uh, trying to get to the Quum, the Quantum Moon right now. That's fine, though. We were planning on that death. Okay. Here we go. This is this is actually the one. Thank you for the raid, though, dude. I appreciate that. I did it. Huh? <clears throat> we are cooking. You believe me? Thanks, dude. I needed that. Okay. This is this is the this is the run and the run. Who might, might be your favorite word now? Thanks. Okay. We gotta find it first. It's not there yet, but guess what? Now it is. Nope, not yet. Now it is. Nope. That's okay. There it is. Eggs, it's bedtime. <laughs> it's bedtime.
What you have to do, just booming. Okay, here we go. This is it. What I can't make jokes. Wait. That was actually that was actually really good, Bobby. Okay, so there we go. Now it's in there, and now it's gone. Okay. Matching velocity. Okay. Hold. I'm never hitting enter again. I'm only gonna write long diaries. Uh, sure, babe. Uh, uh, I'm a hungry boy. Thanks. Okay. How do we do this? Oh, what's that? Oh, that's my shadow. Wait. What's the shadow mean? That's interesting. This day. Velocity match. No. I feel like I, I could feel like I'm doing something here. Quantum moon. Yeah, we, we know. I wonder if. let it go into me or do I get out of the ship and just jump I don't want to I don't want to fuck this up okay I'm just gonna let it I'm gonna let it hit me and see what happens if it fucks up then I'm awkward okay now we know that that wasn't the play we, 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 we're gonna go for part two here let's go find it and then we're just gonna dive into it Where is my scout? Where is my scout? It doesn't show on my map, which is interesting, which means that it's far as fuck, right? Timber Hearth. the moon It is pretty wild when you think about it. 
Thanks, babe. Oh my god. No, that's decent. Thank you. Uh, we, we, we've done that. We have flown straight to the sun. It is not a good thing. Here we go. There's the moon that we're looking for. There's our good guy. So right there is where it experience experiences interference. Okay. there somewhere I want to try I want to try going on it without being on my ship Nothing else has worked. You can try entering it from a different angle, maybe? Like going in from the top or bottom? What have you learned about quantum objects? I've learned that you could travel through them to go down or up. They don't disappear. If there's an image of them, they're, they're still uh, valid. What up, Brittany? I am applying that. When my scout's in here, it's taking pics, right? And then right here, it experiences a little bit of buzz, right? So now what? Retrieve Scout? Sure. No, it's not a picture. It's an interference, which means maybe it's not even getting into it. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe the fuzz is... Maybe it's not even there to begin with. It's, it's not actually... It's, it's not even there. It's not... Yeah, it's not even a thing. This could be the friends made along the way. True. Mm. 
if we try going from this way because we can't lose sight of it at all the whole time. Sounds like this sounds like a uh, skins music. Fuck. Lock on. Mat match velocity. Fuck. Wait. Did the sun look like red for a second when I did that? That was weird. I think it was about to explode. Is it the boom again right there? Okay. Not really. Oh, okay. Maybe I'm just too far. We need some drunken noodles. We go again. Okay, so. Okay, that's good to know, that's good to know. So you can't, you can't do that or, or else you'll lose it. Hmm. There it is again. on there, which is interesting. Come back. So now, now is our scout. Nah, the loop's not almost over. Out even anywhere. No, now, look at, now, now it's look at that. Now it's fucking it's goofed again. Huh. It's weird.
Well, we're gonna probably die before we get onto it, but that's okay. We had a good time. Shit. Oh, that's interesting. I think I touched it and it didn't disappear. Hmm. That is interesting. Oh, so I'm still looking at it. Oh, so you know what I have to do then? Hold on. Maybe what I have to do is this. it a bunch as I'm going into it. Like that, right? Yeah, that's the way to do it. Fuck! That felt good. That felt right! I'm driving directly into the sun on purpose. Okay. I'm going to try one more time, then I'm playing Fortnite. Almost seven hours of this shit. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go. No, I'm having fun. I'm having fun. Um... Between observing that would disappear when no one was watching it, but no one was watching it. No, my name Solana landed a shuttle on the quantum moon. 
church research memos mentioned a quantum moon that no Heath Parathy has been able to land on. Okay. I know my name, someone landed her shuttle at the quantum moon's south pole and prepared to make the rest of the journey on foot. So we have to go... We have, we have to go to the South Pole, it seems, is the is the play. <clears throat> Quantum Tower, the shit. This tower held knowledge of Anomai needed to make his or her first quantum journey. Observing a quantum object, observing an image of a quantum object, these are the same. The Nomai called this the rule of quantum imaging. Remember, the other quantum shards have other lessons to teach. <clears throat> he needed to make his first quantum journey. Observing a quantum object, observing an image of a quantum object are the same. Okay, so... Is it saying I technically don't need to see it to get to it? Is what, or what? I don't, you know, is that what they're saying? As long as, long as I take a picture of it, we're good. Mike? Oh, sorry. Yeah, I was eating my uh, my dinner. Oh, what I said was taking a picture is that just as good as seeing it? Essentially, like if I have a picture of it, that's considered. I don't even I don't remember what I said. To be honest. So is that picture being there mean that means I can, I'm still seeing it. So if I go into it, I'm still seeing it. Regardless. Maybe that's what we're talking about. Let's fucking go in there already. Thank fucking god. Finally! Jesus Christ. We did it, we're on the quantum moon! Who are you? Fuck you! Nah, I'm kidding, that's actually so sad. Oh my god. I can't believe we're on this. I can't believe we're quoom. I can't believe we're quooming. Booming so hard. What the shit? Oh God. <laughs> Recall the rule of the sixth location. You've recalled the rule of the quantum imaging. Recall the rule of quantum entanglement. Huh? Okay, let's... Six location. You have recalled the rule of quantum imaging. And then the rule of quantum entanglement. So all three, what does it do? What does it mean?
Oh, is that the sixth location right there? Hold on. These are, the, these are the different plants. So that's where the quantum moon is right now, I guess. We're around the giant's deep. One, two, three, four, five, six. So those are the twins. That's the hearth. That's Bramble, or uh, not Bramble, that's uh, Brittle Hollow. That's Bramble, and this is the eye, I think. Or a black hole or some shit. So that's the sixth planet, I guess. Is, is the eye the sixth planet? Hmm. Oh my god, and the, and the tower moves. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Let's think. What the fuck is that? Huh? What, whose ship is this? <clears throat> I am here. After watching it wander the skies for so long, I am about to stand for the first time in the quantum moon. As expected, my shuttle has landed on the moon's south pole. I will make the remainder of my journey on foot. But that was probably, we probably saw Solanum's dead body. We don't know why the quantum moon always welcomes its visitors at the South Pole, just that this is true. As a child, I considered such unknowns sinister. Now, though, I understand they bear no ill will. The universe is, and we are. I am ready. Okay. Do I take his fucking ship and go somewhere? I think so. Wait, so where is this? This is... This, this is, uh... We've been here before. This is, uh... Well, this is the observatory. Okay. Hmm. This is a different ship. This is cool. What about this? Oh, that's the black hole right there. That's, that's, there, look at that. That's one of them. Huh. So that just sends us out there to the middle of nowhere. Okay, so we were just on uh, Brittle Hollow. And then... Hmm.
Yo, Nick, thanks for the resub, by the way. Appreciate you, dude. Hmm. Huh. This is, uh... Very interesting. Because now we know how to get on the quantum moon. Oh, so that means I could wait. So that means I could do like any any of the quantum shit now. Oh, I'm gonna meditate. So like anything that's that moves, I could like do shit. Like any of the trees in the hollows, or the poem, like all that shit now. As long as we have a picture, we're able to like manipulate reality. That's cool. Thank, thank you. Oh yeah, thank you guys for um, for helping as like little and like fairly as you have too. Yeah, no, we got a lot done. How would you say there's like a, a decent amount left, like for the, for the most part? Hmm. Yo, Becca, have a have a good night. There is. Okay, cool. Um. Yeah, it's probably a good a good spot to say. Yeah, we do have a lot of we yeah we got a lot of fucking uh, shit solved, which is cool. Okay, so we know about we know about this guy. That's the that's the seed. I kind of want to check. I kind of want to check out the um, the forest real quick and see if there's anything funny there that we can. Oh, that, is that it? No, that might be it, actually. Yeah, no, I know. I, I really like this a lot, too. Okay. Sack here. Let's do this. Shit. Nope. So if you take a picture, oh bro, you don't even see it. Oh, there it is. Hmm. Yeah, I have a flashlight. Yeah. Okay, never mind. Okay, that's cool. We, we now know a lot, and the fact that we landed on the quantum... We actually did a fuck ton today. We went to the quantum moon. We found uh, all the people dead, uh, all those people floating on Dark Bramble. Uh, we did a few towers. Yeah, I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to chill there. That was good. And yeah, sorry if I seemed like impatient at times, but sometimes like games, if like uh, I'm like struggling, but I'm also not trying to get help, it's like you because I want to figure it out on my own. So I, I might seem a little like standoffish, but that's just me like trying to uh, figure it out, you know.